Hi YouTube, how are you doing? And welcome to A Dead of Night. This is a very special game because it is real. Not in the way that Unreal Engine 5 games look real. No, this game is actually real because it uses real life actors and real life footage as the way you control and see the game. It is absolutely awesome. I played it a really long time ago. It was actually one of the first horror games I played on the channel besides Phasmophobia, uh, but it was amazing. And I played it on normal mode and I got my ass absolutely whooped by probably my favorite villain in any horror game ever, namely Jimmy. If you've seen him, he is so iconic. He's like a clown looking guy uh, and he tries to bonk you with a stick now in this video We're gonna play on extreme mode, which is the highest difficulty in the game I can't wait to experience it all again and uh, pay even more attention this time and get absolutely destroyed by Jimmy It's gonna be awesome. I hope you enjoy if you're not subscribed, please do so if you like the video like it If you dislike it, dislike it, but let's not waste any more time. Oh, let's hop into the game. Let's go Oh, baby. Here we go <laughs> That's the hotel. Oh boy. It's a spooky stormy night. I'm ready to get bonked by Jimmy. <laughs> Hi. So this is actually a like a ghost game as well. There is ghosts in this hotel, and we have to use our spirit box to talk to the ghosts. Oh, it's Jimmy. Uh -oh. <laughs> I forgot the story almost Hello? entirely. Maya, it's Hannah. Hannah, where are you? Where you all went are off and you? left me behind. I love the accent. Where are you now? What's this number? We've all booked into a hotel at the Redwood. How far away are you? I don't know. I'll have to call when I get there. You can't. There's no signal. Well... Doesn't matter. Just go to bed, Hannah. Well, listen. Make sure you. Oh, make sure you don't open the second door. Oh no, it got cut off. Whatever you do, do not. <laughs> the classic. Yeah, how are you calling if there's no signal, huh? Explain this to me. Ding ding. Oh no, you don't want to ding that. Jimmy's gonna find you. It's gonna ah, block you. Oh my I God, Jimmy. Uh, <laughs> oh, don't be alarmed. Uh, your friends booked you in. Uh, let me just check. Ah, yes. Uh, room 101. Jimmy's it's all terrifying. been paid for, so you don't have to worry about anything. You are very nice friends. Very nice. Uh-oh. And there's uh, quite a few of you I see as well. Nice to see so many fresh, young faces. <laughs> are you Before broken, change. Jimmy? Uh, you're here for the music festival in town, I presume? Yeah, we were supposed to be camping there tonight, but... <laughs> There's hardly weather for that, is there? <laughs> <laughs> uh, will you be staying for breakfast? I don't think so. We'll probably just get going. That's fine. And uh, if you don't mind me asking, Maya, would you be interested in uh, the entertainment tonight? Tonight? Uh, starts around midnight, usually. It's... It's me doing it, <laughs> actually. Comedy. I do this comedy character called uh, Hugo Hunt. He's sort of this comedic sociopath. Uh... Says things that you're not supposed to say and that sort of thing. It's quite popular with students. I don't think so. We're all just going to bed, I think. Oh, God. Sure I can't <laughs> twist your arm on this? It's okay. I'd rather just go to bed. Sorry. Fine. I don't think it's fine. Which way are the rooms? Um, just take the lift. Uh, you're on the first floor. Okay, thanks. <laughs> this interaction. Oh, and, and then drop your key off in the box, uh, if you will, Maya, please, tomorrow. Okay. Hmm. Uh-oh, Jimmy. He's gonna have an evil monologue right now. Best show in town and no takers. <sighs> Who needs... Proper entertainment when you've got YouTube and my face or whatever. Stupid, uncultured. You don't like rude children. They're naughty. What? Don't start this again. Oh no, he's got voices in his head. He's crazy. I don't want to hear it, okay? Not tonight! Naughty children. 
children of bad eggs. They need to be taught a lesson. Oh no, Jimmy. Jimmy, don't. No, Jimmy! Keep it under control! Ah, there he goes. <laughs> the stick! The bong shut stick! Shut up! Just shut up! You always do this! They're paying customers! They haven't done anything to you! Just leave them alone! Bad eggs need cracking. Whack them hard and crack their shell. Kick them down the stairs to hell! You know what you need to do, Jimmy. Show them who's boss. That's the way to do it. <laughs> oh my god. <laughs> he is absolutely impeccable. <laughs> the best villain ever made. Number one is Jimmy. <laughs> the bunkening. I can't wait for spooky bread as well. Uh oh. Maya, don't go out here. You're gonna get bonked. That's it. Go to sleep. Um, literal kidnapping. My door's locked. Why didn't you take your key, idiot? Oh, we're taking the elevator. Let me guess. The front door's gonna be locked. We're not gonna be getting out of here, huh? <laughs> yeah, I don't think I was supposed to see that. That picture is also insanely cursed, by the way. Oh, signal! Take all the keys! Master key two. Oh, baby. Spirit box! <laughs> you have to find out what he did and tell everyone. We can realize what he did. Let's go. <laughs> Damn, this game is awesome. Here we go. Sea View Hotel has a dark past. Its ghosts have a story to tell. I honestly forgot about this. I don't know how, because this is like such an important part of the game. Use the ghost and spirit receiver to talk to them. They'll tell you Jimmy's secrets. <laughs> but Jimmy must hide the truth. He's got a bonk stick and he's ready to bonk at all costs. <laughs> oh God. Here we go. Alrighty, let's get in there. <laughs> that was awesome. All right. Okay, here we go. Oh boy. Uh, so this is our spirit box. It can detect spirits' voices if you're near enough to them. If you haven't seen it, go to the menu and watch the tutorial. Yes, we are. We are fine. Let's go. Uh, start conversation with spirits by asking introductory questions like, are you French? If there's no reply, there are no spirits around. A loud noise means there's a spirit in a high energy state near. Uh, Hello. Who's there? Anyone? I have no items to talk to you. You have no items to see yet. Is someone there? Are you pizza perchance? Are you Is grandma? Okay, I don't think there's a ghost here. It would make sense because we literally just started. Okay, well, this is the ground floor, which is the safe zone. Jimmy cannot attack us on the ground floor. It's also Christmas, apparently. Let me guess, we cannot just leave through the door. What a surprise, the door is locked. Otherwise, the game would be very short. You would get a special ending, leave get leave ending. Oh, we're in the dark. Weren't we supposed to talk to ghosts in the dark? Is anyone there? Is anyone here? I don't know if there's, if there's a ghost on the ground floor. I'm, I'm, I'm assuming there's not. I think we should look for a compass, right? Uh, so we need to go on the first to the first floor and start looking into rooms to just look for items. Uh, let's see, call the lift. Oh boy. This game just starts with, like, no explanation at all. You just have to figure it out. Uh, press to go to the lower ground. Can we not go into the basement because it's locked? Um, and we don't have a scrying mirror right now. We're gonna figure this out. So there's... It's literally just, like, a free roam game, and we have to fig... Hello? 
Is anyone there? Someone's crying. What? In here? Hey. Oh, don't, don't, don't call out the Jimmy, idiot. Oh, there's a ghost. Is anyone there? Is someone there? I can hear the the loud brrrr. Is someone there? What? I can hear a, a huge difference there. There's got to be a ghost. Is someone there? I, I think we first need to collect some clues in the in the hotel. We first need to go into the main hotel and then come back here later. But uh, that's good intel, though, that we know there's a ghost in this area in the basement. Of course there will be a ghost in the basement. Uh, where else would there be a ghost? Anything else here? Probably these doors are all just closed. Yeah, okay. Uh, well, let's take the elevator to the first floor. Uh, and then we go into the danger zone because we know Jimmy can be on the first floor. But we need to find some evidence first. We need to see if we can save our friends. Uh, if we can find... Oh, what the fuck? Hello? Let's get the absolute living crap out of me. <laughs> Ghost girl? Wait. I want to talk to you. Can we not talk to you? You noted girl in the basement. Wait a minute. I got I got a, a clue I can now talk about. That was not Jimmy. That was girl in the basement. I want to talk to you. Man, this game is awesome. <laughs> I forgot how cool this was. Let's see. Can we talk to you now? Can I talk about the girl in the basement? Who's there? No one? I can't hear you. The spirit is too distant. Try to move closer. Okay. Are you... Wait a minute. Are you at the end of this hallway, perchance? Or just over here near the elevator? Hello? 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 A spirit is making contact. Try to... Here, are you the girl? Can I talk about this? Uh, when you meet spirits, you can ask them questions, pair their replies to make connections. When you're alone, you can review the spirits' replies here. Ask their name. What's your name? I'm Amy Bell. Amy Bell? I'm Tess. Aww. Ask spirits about things you've seen in contact with Amy. Dude, the game is starting off strong. Okay, so we have uh, information about the girl in the basement. So can we... Talk about that? You'll see the reply when selecting the item. Okay, let's talk about this. I saw a girl in the basement crying. Who was she? That's me. It was me. A boy called Jimmy locked hey. in the basement. Then he started stealing things from me. What? The, a boy called Jimmy? So this is when he was a child? Uh, a boy called Jimmy locked me in the basement. Then he started stealing things from me? What did that go? Uh, add to pair. Oh, okay. Interesting. So I need to now get more information. Okay, so we've talked to you a little bit, but I don't think we can get more information out of you right now because we don't have any more things to talk about. Okay, really cool. Um, so let, let's move on for now. I'm sorry, Amy, but come back here later. Uh, we're gonna call the elevator now and start looking on the first floor if we can find any evidence about Jimmy's dark past and what he's done here. Uh, so the first floor does also mean that we could be attacked which is uh terrifying because we are playing on uh extreme difficulty remember the highest difficulty in the game oh boy here we go into the danger zone uh we were staying in room 101 right let's start going that way now, i'm pretty sure the game randomizes every time uh every time you play room 101 let's check it did we have any any stuff in our room? I doubt it. Oh, this is our stuff. Search here. We got a compass. Look at that. It points towards nearby spirits. I understand. And the key, the di the room. Wait, you found a key labeled storeroom. And what's this? You found an old wooden paddle or beater. What? Try right, keys to open. Oh, hey, wait. The try keys open the inventory, face the door, and select a key. Okay. Doors can be locked or unlocked with the right key. 
Uh, so we got a key and we got a wooden paddle. So we might talk. We might be able to talk to, uh, I don't think we're going to be able to talk to Amy about that, but okay. We got a key to the storeroom. So we should probably check that out. But first, before we go out, we should really look through the people to see if Jimmy is going to kill us. I don't know if Jimmy is going to like at least chill a little bit at the start or if he's going to immediately go sicko mode on me. So we have an arrow here. I'm assuming this is just going to lead to Amy. We should really be looking for that scrying mirror. You need to find a scrying mirror. Exactly. We can look for the storeroom by door. Aha! We have reached the storeroom. Okay. Uh, move into the room. Thank you. Can I pick up the flashlight? A Ouija board! We can talk to the... We can find the ghost room. Uh, yeah, I don't think there's anything here. All right, that's one or three. Let's go into 102. Yeah, because we got the master key, right? So we can go into every door. Uh, but Jimmy probably also has one. Aha, uh -huh, you found some childish violent drawings. We could probably talk to Amy about that, I would assume. And the, the key. You found the deadlock key to room 102 so we can lock ourselves into this room. And then stay safe from... Uh, they safe from him. Should we? Um, okay, he's not here. Jimmy is on this floor looking for you. Stay away from him. Uh-oh. Um, is he here? Oh, this is terrifying. I hate it here. Okay, I don't see him. Fuck, I need to go to the elevator. I want to get the hell out of here. I don't see no shadow. I don't see no shadow. Go. Go! Go! Get out of here! Never the elevator's too slow. Go to the go to the lower ground, we can talk to Alright, we're fine. He's far away, we're okay. We're gonna talk to Amy about these chill children's drawings to maybe see if they're from Jimmy. Because that would be significant. Maybe we can combine those two knowledges then. Can I talk to you real quick? Is anyone there? Anyone there? I got this as well. Is, Is it, it Amy? Amy? Yeah. Okay. Amy. Can I talk to you about this? Maybe. Who drew those violent pictures? The boy used to draw them. Aha, the boy used to draw them. And then... Where did the wooden paddle come from? Does she know? Okay, you don't know. A boy called Jimmy locked me in the basement. I'm gonna say combine these two knowledges. Uh, a boy called Jimmy and the boy used to draw violent pictures. Match two replies you think connect to work out the spirit's story. Air sighting replies with item replies for faster progress. Sighting replies with item replies. Is this, ask if these are linked. When you said Jimmy stole things from you, does that have anything to do with what you said about those violent pictures? I, that doesn't seem to make much sense, huh? Okay. <laughs> yeah, that doesn't seem to make much sense. Okay, but at least we identified that Jimmy... Uh, so we're not just talking about current day Jimmy. We're also talking about uh, child Jimmy. Uh, I think I'm gonna go... Can I go to the second floor as well? Because I don't want to go to the first floor because there's where Jimmy is, right? But I think we're just... I think we're gonna continue, and we're maybe gonna go the other way. Because we need to find a scrying mirror, we need to find more evidence. Uh, so we got a lot of looking around to do. Ah! Jimmy! Jimmy, no! Jimmy is coming. Oh, lordy, coming. Go in here. I see you. Abort mission. Move into the room. Search. Okay, there's nothing in here. No deadlock key? That's really bad. Is he gonna come in here? Uh-oh. Okay, I think I'm gonna go across the to the other room. Okay, here we go. This is terrifying. I hate it here. Fuck this game, man. Go into this room. I should've looked- Oh god, it's dark as hell! I can't do anything in here. Oh, does he see this? What am I gonna do if he comes in here? I don't know- I, I can't- it's too dark. Okay, but he's not here. All right, I'm going. That's messed up. Okay, we're going away from- uh, ah! He was right there. I don't know if you saw it, but he was right fucking there. Go in this room. No, I do 
don't have this key. Why not? I have the master key. Oh, he's right by me. Fuck, it's dark. What have I done? Ah! Hide in the bathroom. I'm going to get bonked. It's bonking time. Uh-oh. What? He is leaving? I don't believe it. Why would he not check the one hiding spot? What a dumbass. Okay. I lived? I lived! Look through the spying glass. Is he gonna bait me? Like, is he right in front here? I do not see him. I think we- I think we lived. Okay, he's far away. Leave through the room. We already checked this other room across, right? So we're going this way instead? Uh, where am I going? I'm going to 20. 120. Man, I forgot how scary this game was. Finally, we found a room that has light in it. God damn it. Okay, what's in here? We found an ornamental sword. Okay. <laughs> I don't think Amy's gonna know much about a fucking sword, but... Okay, we are getting more notes, though, which is important. I think we should continue going to the right here. 102 we already checked. 103 we already checked. Uh, at the back here, we did not check. Oh, she is. Why Why does he announce his, his like, arrival so spookily? Okay, nothing in here. Just give me the deadlock key. Okay, we can lock ourselves in this room, but we can also lock him in this room, right? Wait a minute. What if I do something extremely stupid? Can I yell out for Jimmy and then go to the other room and then <laughs> lock him in this room? Call out. I'm going to save. Hey. Oh. Okay. Well, he's... Why did I scream? He's so far away. That's so dumb. I, I'm an idiot. Wait, is there blood on the ground here? You see this? Come on, we're never getting any. Oh my god, stop giving me deadlock keys. I do not care. Is he gonna go into the other room? Um. Jimmy's nowhere to be found. What if I call out to him? I think I got a plan. I think I got a plan. Call out to Jimmy. I'm here. This is science time. I want to see if I can lock him in this room. Oh, she's clo he's close. Not here yet, though. I'm yelling again. Down here. I don't think it's a yokai, guys. I think he can find me. Ah! I okay, here we go. Is he going to hide in the bathroom is the question. Okay, I think he's in the bathroom. Go, 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 go out the door. Go out the door and lock it. Use the key. Uh, how do I use a key? Use the deadlock key to 105. Idiot. Get locked in there. Is he stuck? I think I got him. Wait, what? Wait, he just left? I don't... I think he wasn't in there. Fuck. That was my strategy, dude. I thought I was gonna... I thought I was gonna lock him in that room. I don't think it worked. <laughs> he outsmarted me. Alright, I'm leaving. Goodbye. Goodbye, cruel world. Um, is he far this way? Run to the lift? Yeah, I think I want to leave. <laughs> I think I want to get to the second floor. I don't... I don't like it here. Go to the second floor. Okay, we are good, though. That was... That was pretty nice. <laughs> I don't think I locked him in that room. Because that was my that was my plan there. Uh, it's such a party in here, man. Where are my friends, by the way? Uh, I'm gonna go to... Start here. It's pretty dark out here. Oh, it is so heckin' dark. Uh, oh. We cannot go to any of these locations. Interesting. Okay. So I'm assuming we need to stay on the first floor. 
until we have like progressed in the story uh, i cannot move into this room i cannot move into this room okay a 21 nice we found another room okay aha uh -huh, we found a cloth covered in blood stains now we're cooking with portals You found the child's purse! Okay, wait, that's what he stole! We found bottles of whiskey and other spirits! Dude, we're going sicko mode! Okay. Wait, we got so much evidence, we're gonna go back to- We're gonna go back to Amy now? But is he gonna attack us? Dude, insane speed. How was everything in one room? Okay. We need to get the hell out of here, we need to get back to Amy. Cause that's probably what he stole. He probably stole the purse, right? I would assume. I'm going the wrong way. I'm going the wrong way. And I am... I guess I will just have to deal with it. Let's check these rooms, and then we are completely done on the first floor. Because these are the only rooms that we haven't checked yet. Get another fucking deadlock key that I will never use. Whatever. Okay, I am all the way at the end of the hallway here. No one. No one's here. It's fine. Save the game. I will save the game. Here you go, game saved. Am I gonna get killed? I'm gonna have to look this way. Do not bonk me. Jimmy, no bonk, please. It's like Swiper. Jimmy, no bonking. Jimmy, no bonking. Jimmy, no bonking. You found a syringe and a bottle of the Yazabam? Are you kidding me? You found- Dude, we're getting so much evidence. Holy. Let's go. All right, now we have pretty much, I think we've opened every single door on this floor. So now it's just, can we get out of here without getting bonkeronied? Oh, he's far, he's far away. Okay, uh, save the game. Here we go. I think we're gonna have to run backwards here at some point, but we're gonna try. Here we go. Where's the exit? Here it is. Wait a minute. Get out of here. Go, go to the left. How is he so stupid? Jimmy sucks, man. He is real bad at this. Nice. All right, we made it out. Let's go. And we got so much evidence to talk to Amy about. I'm assuming the purse is what we're looking for. And we have to connect that with that he stole things from her. her. And then we're going to unlock the next chapter. Uh, cause these ghosts are basically how you move through the story. You have to figure out the story of each ghost to discover Jimmy's secrets. Turn on device. Is someone there? It's gonna be Amy. Man, we got so many things. I can't believe it. Hello, Hello Amy. Is it Amy. I don't think she's gonna know about the... Hi, Amy. Maybe the blood-stained cloth. What do you know about this, Amy? Why is there a blood-stained cloth in one of the drawers? It couldn't have been mine, okay. Why was there a collection of whiskey bottles in one of the rooms? I don't know. But children should drink alcohol. Very much agree, she's based. Where did the bottle of diazepam come from? Oh, it could have been mine? Sorry, I thought you said it couldn't. I, don't know. I found a bottle of turpentine in a lighter. She probably doesn't even know what, what that is. For? Oh, you peas? And now we're gonna Who ask about this. Purse belong to? Probably her. It was mine. Aha! There we go. Ask about the sword as well. Who does the sword belong to? Jimmy had it. I didn't like it. I didn't... Jimmy had it. I didn't like it. Okay, let's connect this and then the purse. When you said Jimmy stole things from you, is that connected with what you said about the purse? Yes. Aha. When I wasn't looking and stole my money. What the hell, Jimmy? But he wouldn't listen. Oh, what the hell? Okay, Teddy. We need to go to the ground floor. I see. Okay. 
Wait, she's gone now. And now we have to go to the ground floor for the next location. Okay, I, it's starting to come back to me. I was like a little lost at the beginning of this because I was like, how do you even play this game again? But now I think I'm getting it again. Something is close here. Ah! Oh, hi there. Is it Amy? Okay. Jimmy wouldn't listen, by the way. Amy said, yes, Jimmy took it when I wasn't looking and stole my money. I told him off, but he wouldn't listen. Okay. Let's see. Um, Jimmy's stealing from Amy. You shouting to Jimmy to give your toy back. Why did he take it? Because he's a dick. What a penis. How did he ruin it? How did he ruin it? Um, Jimmy, he gave it back, but then he ruined it anyway. Hmm. Let's, let's see. He ruined it anyway. The toy is missing. Yeah. Uh, did he burn it perchance? Jimmy wouldn't listen. Does this have anything? Oh, we can't combine these. Oh, wait, this. Does that? Have, did he burn it? I don't know why. What you said about Jimmy stealing your toy. Does that have something to do with what you said about the turpentine and lighter? Maybe. What? What a piece of shit! He burned the teddy bear? Okay, we need to go to the first floor now. Dude, we're killing it? Okay. So we found- we figured out the next story. Okay, we're actually speedrunning Amy's story now. Uh, we need to go to the- to the first floor now. Alright, don't get bonked. Where's the compass gonna lead us to? It's gonna be left or right? We're gonna go this way. This way? I think it's this way. I don't see no Jimmy. No! Ah! Uh, I think he was there though. <laughs> Holy, he got me good. <laughs> that was bonk number one. I ge genuinely didn't see him at all. <laughs> what the fuck, dude? Ooh, absolute heart attack right there. Jesus Christ. Okay, we're gonna have to find our spirit box back because Jimmy steals that. I'm assuming we don't lose our evidence, right? Because that's in our brain. Like, that would be ridiculous. Let's see what we lost. Open notes. Okay, we keep all our evidence, but we lose most of the keys. Um, let's look through the hole so we don't go into a... What the hell? Oh, I thought it was... <laughs> I thought it was like a bloody wheelchair. Wait, that wasn't the same room! It was a red chair! Wait, what? <laughs> the fuck? Oh, we found a scrying mirror! Let's go! Okay, okay. Nice. Uh, and to, either by the yeah, yeah, I want to do that in a sec. Use the mirror to find out where to go. It will also help you locate lost keys, compasses, and the ghost box. We found another key. Nice. We finally found a scrying mirror. I really could use a compass though, but whatever. Let's use. I think we could use it at the door. Yeah, let's see. Don't look too long. You're gonna break it. Um. What, Jimmy? Yeah, there's a ghost box. Okay, it's on the first floor. What the fuck, Jimmy? What? I didn't know what that was. Okay. It's on the first floor. Look in the storerooms for the device. Okay, I understood. We need to get to the stairs. I don't think I heard Jimmy yet. I think we're okay. I think we're okay. Okay. Ah, fuck me, dude! go there brother okay go this way go this way ah oh, shit i can't go that way uh how about we go in here and hide that is totally a good idea right you're gonna enter the room let's look for the compass you found a chef's hat okay more evidence i didn't even re and the key labeled stairs floor one okay wait we can unlock the stairs that's huge Lock the room? I can't. 
Is he gonna walk past? Where's this guy? Where's this fucko? Jimmy is a revenant. We need to go back to the left, right? That's where we came from, but that's also where Jimmy is, which means we're gonna get bonked. There's our safe. Yeah, I know. I want to unlock the stairs, and that's also where the storeroom is. So we need to go there anyway. Um, but I feel like I'm gonna get bonked. I don't see Shadow. Ah! Jimmy, fuck off, you dick! Can we run all the way in a circle? Run, run, run. Maybe we can run all the way in a circle? Yes! Wait, I'm insane. I'm insane. Yes! Here it is! Go! Let's go and we find the spirit box again! Oh, he's very close though. Okay. So the spirit box is always in the storeroom. Understood. We have to leave. There's nothing we can do here. Did we just take the elevator? Uh, I think I'm going this way. Wait, maybe we can unlock the stairs here. That's a toilet. Where's the stairs? He's far. Wait, are these the stairs? The exit? Aha! Here we go. Open notes. Use key to floor one. Nice. Okay, so now we have a shortcut. Now we have a shortcut for the rest of the game, I'm assuming. Uh, anyway, we need to find a compass. Go in this room. Okay. We're gonna hide. Do I have the key to this room? We need to find a compass. No shit, Sherlock! I'm a little busy! He's coming in. <laughs> this shit's terrifying, man. I think he's baiting me. I'm going. I'm going through the... I'm going. I'm not even looking. I'm just leaving. I'm gonna get bonked. Run! 119! Absolutely perfect. Okay, here we go. He is still relatively far away, and then we get the compass. Another scrying mirror! Are you fucking with me? <laughs> okay, compass. Here we go. Save the game. Save the game. Now we have to... Uh, use the compass. Why don't you use the compass? Or is it only when I'm outside of the room? He is nowhere. He is not here. Okay, he's far away. We need to go this way. Run! It's here! Go in the room! He's- it's, uh, it's in one of these room. Rooms. I think so. And you keep- Oh my god, you found some old suitcases and we're finding more evidence? I can't lock the door. I don't- I don't have this key! Okay. Please don't find me. <laughs> Fuck. Okay. Uh-oh. Oh, I'm gonna get bonked. It's ready to be bonked. I'm just, it's bonk time. What? What an idiot! What's wrong with this guy? He's not there, right? He's not. He's not waiting. You're being very rude, Maya. You're being very rude, Maya. It's a trap. No, we're fine. He's hiding. I don't think he could make. Okay, I have to go this way. And then it's in this room. Is it here? Or is it in the- it's probably in this room, right? Room 109. Huh? Maybe in here? Oh, we found trophies! Hello! Okay. Nope. Oh, there we go! What the hell?! Okay, sometimes you gotta move around in a bit of a weird way to trigger these cutscenes. Okay, let's get the shit out of me. <laughs> Goodness gracious. Hi, Amy! Is it Amy? <laughs> what the fuck? Are you okay? I saw you holding a toy on fire. What happened? My hands got burned. Aww. It was really hurting. I couldn't tell anyone. Oh. The sword! What? 
On the second floor? Wait. Wait, we're done with a Amy. We've talked to Amy. My hand got burnt. Okay, we need to go to the second floor. We've already been uh, on the... Uh, save the game. Okay. And we already have the sword. We got so much evidence, dude. We need to go to the second floor if we can avoid Jimmy's freaking imminent bonkening. Go, 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 go. Why is it crying? Is that, does that mean we still have more to talk about with Amy? Let's just go to the second floor now. All right, good shit. And, and Jimmy is on the first floor, which means we're going to be safe on the second floor. Did they have different? I think they have different floor. <laughs> Let's see, where are you gonna lead me? This way. We should be safe for a little bit. What? Oh. Hi there. Jimmy, I'm Dr. Bose. I'm you... just here to have a little chat, okay? Forgot about that name. <laughs> He's Dr. Angry. Thank you, Jimmy, I won't be long. Uh, it's not the same spelling, but that's the Dutch word for angry. Imagine you noted man in the corridor Is it here Is anyone there? I can't hear you. Let me guess you're in this room Move into the room also check this real quick You found a wishing line on a rolling pin, okay? Are you here? Is anyone there? Hello? Hello there. What's your name? Dr. Bush. <laughs> Dr. Bush. I'm a clinical psychiatrist. I saw you. Is this you? I saw a man knocking on a door, telling Jimmy he was there to help. Who was it? It was me. I got a call from Rose. Jimmy's mother. Rose? She wanted me to talk to Jimmy. Find out what was bothering him. But Harvey was worried about Jimmy's mind and the things he was imagining. Maybe the drawings? Maybe about the drawings? Who drew those violent pictures? Jimmy. Jimmy? Is that what you're talking about here? Pair this plus this? When you said Harvey was worried about Jimmy's mind, does that have anything to do with what you said about those violent pictures? Let's go. They suggested a turbulent personality, but I wasn't particularly concerned until I started to realize how far his imagination went. Uh oh. And we are speedrunning, by the way. I remember being stuck on these things for ages. What is that? You need to go to the first floor. Okay, we need to go back to the first floor now, dude. You're sending me from left to right from all over the place. He's not here, right? He wasn't on this floor at all. I'm not- I'm just gonna assume he's not here. Okay, this way, yes! Fuck, it's so hard to find these places. Okay, this way? Is it in this room? It's literally pointing straight towards this room. Is it in this room? Is anyone there? Uh, are you in this room? Ah! <gasps> Oh. <laughs> oh my god. That scared the shit out of me. Goodness gracious. <laughs> Fuck me. Is it Dr. Bose? Yes, I'm Dr. Bose. He's Dr. Bose? I saw you holding up a dead animal on a wire. What had happened? Oh, well, the wire. Oh, the classic, classic telltale serial killer psychopath things. So I asked him to think of something nice he could do for me. I was surprised. He came up with an idea right away. What? What is it? Why was there a washing line tied around a rolling pin? I tied them together. It was an experiment. What? <laughs> I tied the washing line and rolling pin together. It was an experiment. What? 
What type of experiment? I found some trophies. Who won them? I don't know. Oh. I saw some suitcases in a chest. Who did they belong to? Maybe he cooked something? I don't know. Maybe he... Oh. Wait, let's see. Chef's hat. Who did the chef's hat belong to? Jimmy found it and put it on. Is that related to the nice thing? Maybe he was trying to cook something. Maybe he's going to cook the rabbit. <laughs> when you said Jimmy came up with an idea to do something nice for you, is that connected to what you said about the chef's hat? I would make that let him cook. Yes. Uh huh. make something for me, so I followed him to see what he was going to do. Oh, here we go. I assume we're going to the kitchen next. Yep. Wait, ground four. Yeah, that's where the kitchen is. Okay. Nice. Just have to go to the ground floor. Oh, we're gonna get bonked right here. Get ready to be bonked. Oh, Jimmy. I still hear crying. Go. Oh. Nice. Did it, and luckily, this is the fastest elevator the world has ever seen. I am really appreciative of that. Okay, what's so, up? Man, we've been chaining these so... We've only gotten bonked once on extreme mode. I remember getting bonked absolutely constantly. <laughs> when I played this the first time. Kitchen back here in the staff area. Can we talk to you? Is someone there? You probably need to see an event first, huh? You probably need to turn around and then it's going to be Jimmy. Oh, nope. This is a great idea, Jimmy. Oh, I reckon you'll make a great cook one. Day. Every time it's just. Oh, why shit don't you bring it up to me when you're done? I'll wait for you, okay? It gets me every time. Holy fuck! <sighs> is it Doctor Bose? <laughs> is it Doctor Bose? I see. Okay, here we go. I saw you outside the kitchen talking to Jimmy. What were you doing? Jimmy was making me a sandwich. He brought it up to my room as I asked. Okay. I didn't suspect anything was wrong at first. Uh oh. Poison sandwich? Is it been poisoned with diazepam? I don't think that works that way. Where but... did the bottle of diazepam come from? It can help treat impulsive behavior in some people. Okay. What about the whiskey? Why was there a collection of whiskey bottles in one of the rooms? Funny said. Well, they were probably from the bar. I mean, that makes a lot of sense. Can we talk about the sword? Who does the sword belong to? I saw Jimmy playing with it. That's I not. It was dangerous. Yeah, that seems extremely dangerous. Excuse me. I'm assuming this is not connected to the. What's about the suitcases? Suitcases? Oh, it didn't have an answer. Okay. Um, how about this or together with diazepam? I doubt- wait, wait, let's- we can ask about the cloth. Why is there a blood-stained cloth in one of the drawers? It was mine. What? I kept it in case I needed it as evidence. Oh, did he poison you? Wait a damn minute. Add the pair. Uh, and then this. When you said you didn't suspect anything was wrong, does that have something to do with the blood-stained cloth? It was my first encounter with the ah. sense of humor. Let's go to your flawless... What the fuck? Is it a hammer? Third floor! Oh, we're going, we're going places? Sense of humor? What what the hell are you talking about? That doesn't seem very funny. Okay, third floor. It's hammer time. And I'm so glad Jimmy is not down here. <laughs> He's so... Glass sandwich? Oh. Put ground up glass in the sandwich. Dude, what a fucking psycho. He was bonking before he... <laughs> He's always been bonking. What an absolute monster. Ouch. I mean, probably you'll bite down on it and like 
figure out you shouldn't swallow it, hopefully at least, otherwise you're gonna have big trouble. Um, all right, where do you want me to go? Third floor, here we are. This way? I'm assuming Jimmy's not here. Blah, 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 blah. Okay, it's here? Or do we gotta see something? You okay. I'm telling you, he's been lying about everything, probably lying about the other stuff as well. Don't be ridiculous. He wouldn't lie about something like that. You sure about that? He lies about everything. Open your bloody eyes, Rose. Ridiculous. Oh, that's right. Walk off. I'm not listening, Harvey. You've just got it in for him. It's the truth. Okay, we gotta go there, but I'm also curious. What is this room? By right door? Okay, this doesn't do anything. Uh... Because we could also look for some evidence. But I guess we're gonna do that when we... If we get bonked, we're gonna look for evidence. Because then we can do two birds with one stone. We can look for evidence. At the same time, we're looking for a compass and a scrying mirror. And we... Oh! Got a key to the storeroom. We should unlock that, because otherwise we can't get the thing here. Uh, anyway, um... Turn on the device. Hello? Hello? Is this Harvey? What's your name? A new person? Harvey. Harvey. Oh, you run the place back in the day. I saw a man saying Jimmy had lied about the assault. Who was he? It was me. Jimmy had made accusations about the doctor. Rose believed him, but I'd heard that story somewhere before. What? Jimmy had made accusations about the doctor. Rose believed him, but I'd heard that story somewhere before. Wait, did he? Oh, you piece of shit. Uh, let's see. What do we talk about? Suitcases? I saw some suitcases in a chest. Who did they belong to? Rose, but she never used them. Oh. Rose, but she never used them? Wooden Where did paddle? Where the wooden paddle come from? That's super ducked up, indeed. It was always under the counter in reception. I don't know where it came from. Sword? Who does the sword belong to? We had a display of medieval weapons. Jimmy stole it. Okay, we're finding so much evidence. How Why about the whiskey? There a collection of whiskey bottles? Jim Rose is Jimmy's mom, yes. I don't remember. There's nothing wrong with having a drink. <laughs> what the hell? I found a bottle of turpentine in a lighter. I love how you can talk about all these things even when they're already being used for other things. They were my things, but I didn't keep them together. What? Where did the bottle of diazepam come from? Yeah, why do you have that shit? Probably the doctor left it. That makes sense. I found some trophies. Who won them? Can we talk about these events as well? I don't know. Can we talk about the fire event? I saw the little girl, Amy, holding a toy on fire. What happened? She was burned pretty badly. Interesting. You can have so much information. Okay, the girl was burned pretty badly. Uh, can we talk about the blood cloth? Why is there a blood-stained cloth in one of the drawers? And then this, these two? I don't know. But it oh. might have had something to do with the doctor. Dr. Bose encountered Jimmy's humor. We can't talk about that. But I saw Dr. Bose outside the kitchen talking to Jimmy. What was he doing? He probably doesn't know. How would he know? The doctor was trying to educate you. Get him to help out. Big mistake. Big mistake? Okay. I saw Dr. Bose holding a dead I'm assuming we need more information here. I don't What's think we have him? enough. Let's look at the scrying mirror after this. He found it somewhere. What he was doing with it is another story. Okay. Let's, uh... Let's, uh, use the scrying mirror. What? What, what the music is Jimmy here? Why would he be here? Because it's probably gonna. What do we need? Like, what item are we looking for? Hi, Jimmy. <laughs> we are looking for Amy again on the first floor. Wait, what? Okay, a uh, huh? I guess this is over for now. All right, we're going to Amy. Also, you wait. You on the witch floor? Oh, they're both on the first floor. Well, let's go there then, I guess. Excuse me, we're getting all ghosts back to back to back. 
You're on the third floor, I know, but what do I need for you? Um. What? This doesn't help me very much. You're gonna show a door? Jimmy. Hi, Jimmy. Yeah, I'm at two stories are going at the same time. I see. I understand what's going on here. Okay. Um. I see. So we need to go to the first floor for those two. I shouldn't have just left the room without looking. That is very stupid, but I did it anyway. Okay. No! Jimmy, you dick! Jimmy, no. Jimmy, no. 302, please let me in. Ah, it's a dark... Dark rope. Uh-oh. It's time to get bonked. Is he gonna... Please walk past. Walk past me. Don't come in here. He's going to catch me. You're safe in the elevator room? Yeah, but I have to get there because he's right there. I don't think if I walk that way, I'm just going to get bonked. Like, why would I run into him? That seems like... But he walks past! That's perfect. Then we can go out and go to to this side. All right, here, I'm going. I'm, I'm, I'm stupid, but I'm going. We're going right. We're going right and we're running. Run the fuck out of here. Never to return. Go, go, go. Take the elevator to the first floor. Ding dong. Let's go. Okay. Man, we have been avoiding Jimmy like a pro. Even on the highest difficulty. This is good stuff. And then we probably need to go to the crying lady here. And it also means he's on the third floor, so he's not going to be here for a second. Um... I hear water oh in the toilet no no go to the toilet idiot let me guess i have to walk i have to look like this you want oh oh god jimmy! damn jimmy's a piece of shit can we go in the toilet? We cannot go in the toilet. Is it Dr. Bose? Yes. Okay. Dr. Spitting out blood. I saw you spitting out blood. What happened? Nice sense of humor. Ah! I nearly choked on it. Damn! Are you talking about this and diazepam? When you said you needed to step up Jimmy's treatment urgently, does that have something to do with what you said about the diazepam? Probably. It wasn't the ideal medication, but it was more I had. Isn't diazepam like a... Needed treating immediately. He was dangerous. Isn't it like a sedative? Wait, what floor did it say? I was looking at chat. Wait, what floor was it? Oh, wait, what did you just say on the screen? Two. Okay, thank you guys, man. I would have been lost without you. Okay, so second floor. What? Where's the lady crying? He's down here? In this corner? In this corner. Oh, here we go. Your whole... What? <laughs> Excuse me, what was that? Hello, lady? Are you in here? You're probably in here. Why are you in here? Is it Amy? Yeah. I'm Amy. I saw you outside a room. Something frightened you. What was it? Ah. I see. Did he threaten you with the sword he stole, perhaps? This one? When you said you needed a doctor, but Jimmy threatened you to stay, does that have anything to do with what you said about the sword? Yes. 
Aha. Did you could have cut off your hand? Alcohol, no! Jimmy! What the hell? Uh-oh. Not the whiskey. He cut... Ah, oh, fuck, Jimmy. Okay, he's nowhere here. I'm gonna get killed. Alright, where, where do we go? This way? I don't see Shadow. We're totally gonna get bonked. He'll go into the room. Is it in this room? Is it here? Close! Is someone there? Hmm. Save the game? Is it in, in this room? No, it's probably in the hallway, which sucks. Ah! <gasps> Never mind. <laughs> oh my god. Okay, well, we found it. Is it Amy? Let me guess, you were drinking whiskey? I saw you drinking something. You didn't seem to like it. What was it? What the heck? It's pro it's definitely this. Um. When you said the medicine tasted horrible, does that have anything to do with what you said about the whiskey bottles? A cloth on her hand just because she got burned? Oh no, what the fuck? Uh, what is this? Oh, the stairway, no! Uh-oh. Uh-oh. Is she gonna stumble down the stairs? Was it on the third floor? Did it say third floor? So high. Oh no. Uh, can we talk to her here, or do we have to go all the way around Is again? Is it Amy? Now? Oh no, she's too. F I have to go all the way, fucking loop back around. <laughs> you dick. All right, here we are. Can we talk to you? Is it Amy? Nice. I saw you at the top of the stairs, on the banister. What were you doing? Oh no. No! What the hell, Jimmy? Uh, Amy said I felt really like. Do we have to go to the bottom? No. Don't show this to us. Don't traumatize me. This hotel's so nice, too. Let me guess. We have to look from the side. Oh. Wait, are you kidding me? Oh, no! What the hell? Holy shit. This game is not messing around. <laughs> I forgot about all that, man. <laughs> Holy shit. Feels bad, man. Is it Amy? Echo, thank you for the five. Hmm. I saw you lying at the bottom Amy's of the stairs. Amy's story's so sad. What happened to you? I jumped, but then it all went dark and I couldn't wake up. I can't wake up anymore. I don't know where I am. What the hell? You have completed Amy's story. Damn, dude, Jimmy sucks. That's and that's when Jimmy was a child. Can I talk to you about any of this? 
Okay, I cannot talk to you anymore. Amy is Amy is hopefully moving on. Hopefully we did like a Conrad Stevenson's and helped Amy move on to the place after. Cuz damn, that's uh that's a free this game is not messing around, huh? Holy moly. I forgot just how especially because it's just like truly real, it feels even more messed up. Okay. Uh we should quickly go to the kitchen. And check the scrying mirror. I think we... Because we need to continue Bo's story now. Uh, no, 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 no. I don't want to do this. I want to do scrying mirror. Feels bad, man. Okay, Jimmy. Yes. I'm not interested in Jimmy, though. Okay, this is Dr. Bo's. Your story continues on... The second floor. All right, we're going there first, I think. You probably need a specific item, though. And then your story is on the third floor, I think, right? Yeah, we're gonna save in a moment here. Don't worry about it. Your story is... Oh, yeah, down a hallway. This is so little information. This is... Wait, based on the wallpaper, we can see where it was. I think that was on the first floor, based on the wallpaper. And we still have a compass, too. I think so. I'm not entirely sure. Uh, what the hell is this drawing? Okay, let's go to the second floor first, though, because Dr. Bose is uh, the story we are the furthest in. Alright, uh, are you in here? Hello? You probably need to do look down the hallway, right? Because it's gonna be uh, a jump scare here. Get ready to be jump scared. Oh! <laughs> this won't hurt, Jimmy. All you have to do is to stand still and stop moving around. <laughs> he was way closer than I expected. Is it Dr. Bose? <laughs> oh my god, you're too far away. Where the fuck are you then? Are you in this room? I guess the thing is pointing that way. Why would you be in this room though? That doesn't really make any sense. Maybe it's down the hallway? Is it Dr. Bose? Okay, never mind. It is here, boss lady. Thank you for the five. Okay, what I the hell are you? Needle talking to Jimmy. What were you doing? You were off the bonk. Jimmy refused to let me administer the drug. I had to chase him around the hotel. <laughs> then he told Rose I tried to force him to take it. That I'd used violence. I mean, it was ridiculous. Uh, you do kind of seem a little unhinged at the same time, though. Okay, um. Let's see, maybe it's related. I saw a man saying Jimmy had lied about the assault. Who was he? Oh, we already combined with the... B it was Harvey. Let's see. He knew Jimmy was lying about me. Harvey understood. Is this combined? Can we combine this with this somehow? Air sight. You can't combine that. Okay. Um, I... I saw Amy lying at the bottom of the stairs. What happened to her? No. It was the reason Rose got in touch with me. Damn. Okay, uh, so that was the reason why Rose got in touch with you. Okay. Uh, let's see. Uh, is there anything we could combine with it? Obviously, we could try diazepam and this again, but I doubt that's gonna do anything, because we are... Didn't he have some kind of experiment? Wait a minute. Combine this with the experiment. What is this? When you said Jimmy refused to let you administer his medicine... Did you, like... Does that have anything to do with what you said about the washing line? Because he has some pin? experiment or whatever. I don't know. Okay, that doesn't do anything. Uh, what, what the hell are you talking about with that experiment? Let's try this one. I don't think this might When you said Jimmy refused to let you... Thank you, Anonymous, for the gift subs. Does that have something to do with what you said about the diazepam? I mean, I don't think so. Oh, no, he's going away. I think I'm, uh, you can't just spam guesses. Uh, event I think I need some kind of, I think I need something else. I don't think I have what I need here. The hell is that? I already checked in here, didn't I? What the hell is that sound? Is that Jimmy? Let's use the mirror. Because I think we need a, like, accusation, right? Oh my god. We need something uh, that Jimmy accused Dr. Bose of. Let's see, is it just gonna sh show me this location again or is it gonna show me a different item? What item? 
Yeah, we need a piece of paper. I think. Wait, that's a paddle. Never mind. We need the paddle. Oh, the paddle! Of course. <laughs> We, he's he pretended or maybe it was I don't know it, it, Dr. Bose doesn't seem the best doctor to be honest But I also wouldn't have uh, my head screwed screwed on straight If I just got a freaking glass sandwich from a kid I would probably also be a little angry <laughs> But anyway, okay uh, Let's see So let's talk to you again and interact and put the paddle on there Okay, uh, Dr. Bose It's me. Does this have anything to say or combine with the paddle? Where did the wooden paddle come from? I don't know, but Jimmy found it. Aha. Uh -huh. I see. When you said Jimmy refused to let you administer his medicine, is that connected to what you said about the wooden paddle? I would say so. Jimmy said I used uh -huh. to feet. Don't keep the white, thank you for the prime. And we are like cruising, man. It's a phone. She called the police, probably. Phone? I guess we go down the stairs and use the phone? Because the phone is in the. the phone is downstairs. I miss those phones. It's crazy that some people don't know how to use them. I mean, I guess it's just. Like, uh, an old-timey thing, so it doesn't really... It's not weird. Necessarily. Um... What the fuck? What? Excuse me? There's a... Oh! Wait, it's one of my friends. She's freaking kidnapped in the room. 210, can we remember 210? We're gonna have to go to 210 at one point. Oh god, all these rooms are closed. Wait, let's see. Is there any someone else in here as well? Ah, uh -huh, 210 and 29? 210 and 29 have friends in them. We need to figure this out later, so might as well write it down now. 210 and 29. Okay, not this one. Because I, I don't know how many friends. You said we had quite a lot of friends. Nice. You found a poster for Jimmy Hall's comedy act. And another coat. Man, we have... It's crazy we're still alive. I know I'm jinxing myself and we're gonna get bonked any second now. But... We got so much stuff done. Okay, nothing here. I don't think I've heard him at all yet. And then, see, it's 2.13 dark. 2.13 is dark. Maybe people are actually just sleeping in these rooms and I'm just creeping up on them. Wait a minute! That's fucking Jimmy! He's standing right there! Is it- wait, or is it this? Or is it this shadow? It might be this shadow. I think it's this shadow. He wants to bonk. Go into a room. Why not go f Ah! Oh my god, I just dodged. I just dodged a bullet there. Uh oh. He's gonna get me. He fucking knows, dude. We lived. We lived? Did he bait me? Go. Let's go. Just go leave. Just fucking leave and run. Okay. <laughs> Damn it. Fuck. <laughs> All right. Well, I've been bonked. Second bonk. That is actually insane how long we lasted there. Goodness gracious, man. So what did we lose? Did we, we lost our spare box. We lost our compass. But that's honestly fine. Look for sto in storerooms. Well, there's a storeroom right here. How convenient. There it is. Dude, that was easy peasy. We were, I mean, we don't have the compass yet, but besides that, we have... We have the most important item. And then the compass we can always find with the scrying mirror. But I'm just gonna get the hell out of here. 
and go to the elevator. Don't get bonked, please. Otherwise, we're going to infinite bonk. You know what? I'm just taking the stairs. Stairs are safer. I'm probably faster as well because it's literally just one animation. Okay. Uh, I think that's what they were talking about in the cutscene. Is that we need to go with this, right? Maybe. This phone? Is anyone there? 212 as well. I oh, would Jesus. never use force like that on a patient, Mrs. Hall. It goes against everything I believe in. You have to understand, he's making it all up. Okay. <laughs> Good fucking God, man. Is it Dr. Bose? Okay. I saw you trying to explain what happened with Jimmy. You seem desperate. I was worried that Rose would believe Jimmy. Uh -huh. It was a bare-faced lie. But I managed to convince Rose Jimmy was making it up. Okay. Second floor NHS. Okay, we go to the second floor. And we can also go to 212 for a scrying mirror, right? 212, okay. So they should still... I don't know if they if they respawn, but we found a scrying mirror in here before. He labeled stairs to floor one. We already have those unlocked. It doesn't matter. And then is there, there is still a scrying mirror. Nice. Okay. That's super useful. Now let's see if we can... It's... Oh. It's gonna tell us uh, where a compass is, which is the last thing we need to just fucking jump scared me. Okay, compass is gonna be in room number 215. That's extremely close to where we are. That's super useful. Man, the scrying mirror is in amazing. Okay, 215, but I gotta look through the people because he's literally right here. 215. That's just further down. Jump scare time? I don't see anyone. <laughs> Okay, he, he just freaking straight up walked past. He is not baiting me, but he walked to the right. I'm assuming that means he's not baiting me. Because he just, he just literally rushed past. 214? 215, here we go. Okay, and then we're immediately going to get bonked. <laughs> that would be so fucked up. All right, give me a compass. There we go. Okay, we found a compass. Hey, that wasn't too bad. <laughs> okay, well, if we die, we know 215 as another one. <laughs> Let's go. That's actually super useful. Okay. That's so silly. Remember that. Write this down. Write this down. 215. Okay, we should keep going down to the right. Oh, I heard him. I'm going to go. I'm going to go to the right. Well, to the left now, I guess. That is not him. Man, it looks like it's his shadow, though. Holy fuck. Oh, God. Oh, no. 216. Fuck. Maybe I can find this... The key. Ah, oh, shit. I need to go all the way... Oh, I thought he turned the light off. Uh-oh. He knows... He's a knower! What do I do now? He closes the door, but does that mean he's gone? Or does that mean he's just fucking baiting me outside? Like, is this a 50-50? Don't forget the danger indicator. Yeah, well, the danger indicator... He's far away. I heard him scream down the hallway. You, I heard him scream far away. I think he's gone. Okay, here we go. Nice. Did I even check what's in this room? Wait, I don't think I checked what's in this room. He's literally standing right next to me. Did you see that shadow? What the fuck? I did check what's in this room, huh? Yeah, yeah, but then I got immediately got distracted. Was that his shadow? Am I gonna get killed? <laughs> I swear I saw a sh big shadow right next to him. 
Or right next to the door. All right, whatever. What's the worst that could... What's the worst that could happen? We get bonked? Don't make me laugh. All right, let's hope that's not a shadow. It's not a shadow. It's the fucking mannequins. Jesus Christ. Okay. Oh, there we go. You can't get away from me that easily, Jimmy. I think we should start again, don't you? Why don't you do what I ask you to do this time? That would be a good start, wouldn't it? You're creepy as fuck. Excuse me? <laughs> what? Excuse me, Dr. Bose. I know you're angry and all, but what Dr. the hell? Bose? Yes, I'm Dr. Bose. What the hell are you doing? I saw you sitting on a bed talking to Jimmy. What were you doing? I see. Okay. Uh, so we probably need some kind of like uh, made up story here. What? But we don't have anything. Let's quickly look at the scrying mirror. I think we need a piece of paper here. I think I think I know what he's talking about. <laughs> Definitely doing some weird shit though, Dr. Bose. I don't know what you were doing with that handkerchief, but it was looking very weird. Very creepy. Okay, what is the item we're looking for? So down the hallway. Okay, I guess we have to find that picture. The picture of the children. That's where we gotta go. And then this is Harvey. Which wasn't Harvey also the same hallway? Wait, they're both in the exact same place. What the hell is this? <laughs> what the hell is disgusting? Okay, I think it's on this floor, but I don't remember seeing this picture because it's so damn blurry. Okay, we need to find that picture somewhere. Yeah, yeah, Jimmy, you want to bonk me. I get it, I get it. You're evil. Next DBD killer is gonna be Jimmy. I can't wait for his special bonk ability. Anything in here? A crossbow? Okay. But this is another medi- Oh, God. Oh, shit, this is a bait, right? I think I'm going out and going... I, I think I'm doing it. I think I'm doing something extremely stupid, but it's a plan. It's a plan and it's gonna work. I'm looking this way and I'm going... Run! Ah! Ah! What? How? He walked in, He walked to the right and then he was on the left? How does it work? <laughs> what the fuck? Wait. <laughs> he didn't go that way though. <laughs> what happened? All right, well, which room had a compass again? Because we had one, we had a compass somewhere. Also, now we can just quickly look around. It was 215, which was right around this corner. Is it this way? It's not this way. This way? Yes, okay. This is the hallway. And then over here is... Let's check these rooms for some evidence. Because both their stories lead here. Scrying mirror? Okay. <laughs> Is there any Resident Evil 2? I don't think I uploaded Resident Evil 2. He labeled stairs too. That would be huge. Okay. Check him. Okay, he's far away. He's far away. This is fine. Go, go, go. We have many rooms to check here. Do not be afraid of the bonk. There's four again. Okay. That locked to this room. Give me new evidence. No. Oh, here we go! Accused psych psychiatrist found dead in cell. Had head admits to violent abuse at private school. Okay. That is gonna be it. That's the evidence we're looking for here. Okay. Nice. And now we just need to... Let's check these other rooms here too, because we know that... Don't be here, Jimmy. Do not fucking be here. I'm just going. If you're here, then just bonk me. I don't have- I mean, I guess I do have the mirror right now, but we're gonna find another one. Let's check this one. Uh, look in the storeroom. Yeah, 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 I get it, I get it. We're gonna look there in a second here. Um... A compass! I'm insane! I'm so lucky. And another key. Key labeled storeroom. Okay, well, this shit is going way too well. I was not trying to find any of these fucking items, but I'm finding everything, goddammit. 
Okay. You're not here. All right, we're going back to the stairs now. And then we... Wait, is the compass going to show us? But we don't... Okay, you're down this hallway. There's... Yes, this is the storeroom. That's... No, it's not the storeroom. What the fuck? I thought it was this room. It's close to this, though. Please don't tell me you're at the elevator. Okay. Wait. Well, that's the toilet. It's... On the other side? Is it down... These are all just rooms. I don't know. We're gonna find it. Eventually. But we can also get more evidence. Uh, I found some broken wall mirrors. That's all... I mean, we might need this evidence. I'm just gonna keep going. I don't care. If I die... If I get bonked... That's... That's the end of me. It's bonk time. Wait, this door? Can I open this? Is this a storeroom? Aha! Wait, this has got to be it, right? Come on. There it is! Holy shit, that is way harder to find than... <laughs> than if you have it on the first floor, but we still did it. Now we need to um, go to the first floor again. And then we're gonna get bonked immediately. Is it this way? I don't see shadows. Okay, go, go, go. I just want to get the fu- Shit! No! Fuck you! Run! Run! Just go in this room. 303. Oh, shit! 304! It's a dark room! I hate it. Uh-oh. Okay, uh, what are we gonna do? What's the plan? What's the plan? This is a disaster. I don't know how he works. I'm going. Run to him. I mean, I'm going now, but we need to really make sure that we're looking at the shadows. Okay, there's no shadows here. I don't see anything. No shadow there. This is the wrong way anyway. Fuck me. I'm in danger. He's not here. There's no shadow. That's not a shadow, right? Oh, God. Uh, well, if he's here, I get bonked. Go. Take the elevator. We can get out of here. Go to the first floor. Go, 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 go. Nice. I don't know how he got... <laughs> how he lost me, but I'll fucking take it. All right. Whew. That's scary. And then he's not on this floor at all, so we're fine. Go to the radio. The radio's gotta be a ghost, right? No? This way? Wait, it's not on this floor? It's in this room? Oh yeah, we were- it's just room 216 again. I'm stupid. Of course. Nice, and now we have a shortcut. All right, talk to him. Is, is it Dr. There? Bose? Hello? Is it Dr. Bose? And then we talk about this thing. I'm Dr. Bose. I saw a scrapbook with newspaper articles in it. Who made it? Jimmy made Jimmy. it. Jimmy. It was a warning. I should have seen it coming. Okay. And then we combine. You said Jimmy made up another lie about you. A much worse lie. Does that have something to do with what you said about the scrapbook? Jimmy accused me of the worst crime possible. He took it from a newspaper story he'd read. He was making it all up. Uh-oh. Police. Wee wee. Police at the front door. Okay. Well, I think I can, uh, I think I can guess so I know what happened. Oh. What the fuck? Please open up. Is it here? Oh, there he is. Okay. Uh-oh. He's getting arrested. Is it Dr. Bose? Yes, I'm Dr. Bose. I 
saw you upset and heard the police banging on the door. What was going on? Rose reported me. I knew they'd strike me off. I had no career, no future. Uh oh. I decided to take control once and for all. Uh oh. Um. I decided to take control once and for all. Does that have anything to do with this thing? This experiment that you were talking about? Uh-oh. When you said you decided to take control once and for all, does that have anything to do with what you said about the washing line and rolling pin? I experimented with the washing line, but it was too thin. I found some rope instead. I still had my keys to the hotel, so I crept in one night while I was on bail. What? The basement? What the hell is this? Is this your fucked up way to talk about that? Yeah, I was doing an experiment on how to meet myself. <laughs> what the hell, dude? Okay, we're going to the basement. Uh oh. We're get ready to see something disturbing, by the way. Uh, viewer discretion, obviously. I. I mean, if the situation with Amy is anything to go by, you know it's, it's not going to be pretty. Uh-oh. No, YouTube, don't look. Oh, boy. Oh! Uh-oh. Nope. Um... What the hell with the elevator? Oh, what the? That's the most fucked up. With the elevator? I thought he was gonna jump down the elevator shaft. What the hell? Well. Is it Dr. Bose? Oh, he's for, he's at the elevator. Holy. Is it Dr. Bose? Look at this shit. I saw you tying a rope around your neck. You killed yourself. Why? I'd had enough. There was no going back. My life was over anyway. But it was literally fake. Like, if it was fake, then... What? And if it wasn't, then... You should have gone to jail. <laughs> but if it wasn't, you would have... I mean, I don't know. Damn. That's dark as shit. Uh, there's a show. He didn't think anyone would believe him. He didn't even try. I definitely would have tried. If, if justice is on your side. Okay, we completed Dr. Bose's story. Damn, another fucked up story of one of Jimmy's victims. Presuming it's all true, of course. Which I'm going to trust the victim right now and not the... Maniacal killer <laughs> who is trying to literally murder me as we speak. <laughs> What's in here? Oh, I can go in here. Fuck. There's a ghost nearby. Okay. Wait, is it gonna be backstage? Probably backstage. There we go. Okay, it was just bugged, but now it's good. We're good. Nice. Okay. Good stuff. <laughs> Behold, I am the great Hugo. Oh, baby. I stand alone above all others. This is an insane magic show. What the I hell? I am the light which illuminates the darkness. I alone am master. Holy. That was pretty epic. Can we talk to Hugo now? We're gonna talk to Jimmy himself. He's probably gonna be backstage. Is someone there? Or maybe. The great Hugo on stage. Okay, I'm assuming he's gonna be... Did he drug me? Did he drug the whole stage? Is that his act? His act is just to make people hallucinate and pretend he's a magician. Is it this way? 
There's someone there. Are you backstage, Mr. Hugo? I don't know if we can talk to this guy. Because I think this is not pointing... The, the compass is pointing somewhere else now. It's just like slowly rotating, which means there's nothing else here. I'm pretty sure that's how that works. But let's go to the third floor and go talk to Harvey there. Yes. This very room. And then in here is Harvey, probably. Who's there? Hello? There we go. Hello? Is it Harvey? Yes. Nice. And then what, what is this? I saw someone on stage, a performer, announcing himself as the great Hugo. I never knew it. I never knew him. Uh. I saw Dr. Bose tying a rope around his neck. He killed himself. Why? Because he'd been driven to it. Everyone thought he'd touched Jimmy. Jimmy was clever, you see. Too clever. The doctor had no chance. Poor soul. Well then. So let's see. You are... What is this, though? I saw Dr. Bo sitting on a bed talking to Jimmy. What was he doing? He probably does... He doesn't know. I don't know. Yeah, okay. Let's talk to you about... Wait. This is so far back. This... The man saying Jimmy lied, and then this thing. I saw a scrapbook with newspaper articles in it. Who made it? Jimmy. He used to keep cutouts of news stories about abusive teachers and doctors. He wasn't a normal boy. Aha, uh -huh. and then we combine these. When you said you'd heard the story somewhere before, does that have something to do with what you said about the scrapbook? The system is so cool. It came straight out of it. As soon as I found that scrapbook, I knew where Jimmy had got it from. It was the same, down to every detail. Aha, uh -huh, here we go. So I kind of just found dead. Oh, wait, he liter literally killed him. Is that the same kind of story? Exact same thing happened. Let's check in here. I don't know. If Ooh, new key. Key level storeroom. Always nice to have that, just in case. And see if there's a new compass here for later. Okay. Uh, well, we're gonna. I guess we're gonna follow the compass again. Is Jimmy's probably gonna be here now, though? Which means we're gonna be fucked. We will not be sucked this year. Jimmy, no. Jimmy, don't do it. Go this way. I'm hearing smacking. Don't see no shadow. Wait, it's just rotating as if there's no thing here. No, it is pointing somewhere. It's... Uh-oh. Do not bonk me, Jimmy. No bonk. This is a no bonk zone. It's this way? It's this exact room? Nice. And then someone was knocking on the door. We have to look this way, probably. No, Jimmy, I'm busy. I got shit to do. Uh-oh. Uh-oh. It's time for me to die now. And you know. Um, I'm gonna wait. <laughs> I am not coming out. I'm not even here. It's st stay hydrated, everyone. He's gonna jump scare me out of nowhere. Um, I mean, I guess we'll come out. Okay, he's far away. Now, can we please... Do we have to look through the people or something? Is there a story here? There was oh, what the fuck? Jimmy! I know you can hear me. I know where you made it up, your little story about that psychiatrist. I know where you got it from. I knew I'd read it before. It's in your bloody scrapbook. Come out of here. Jimmy! Ah, I see. How did Harvey get killed then? Uh, I'm going to get killed here myself now. But I have to talk to him. 
He's really far Is away. Are you kidding me? You're in this room? How are you in this room? Or are you down the hallway? Okay, you're down this hallway. Are you here? You're here. Why? Okay, sure. Is it Harvey? Yeah, it's Harvey. Okay. What I were saw you... you shouting, telling Jimmy to admit he lied. Did he? Of course he didn't. He just laughed. Then he started setting little traps for me. Uh oh. So not so little. What is the what is with the crossbow? Where's the crossbow from? <laughs> It was from an armory display we used to have. Jimmy was fond of it. Did he make a trap with the crossbow? When you said Jimmy started setting traps for you, does that have anything to do with what you said about the crossbow? I don't know. Oh, no? Oh, I thought he was going to set a crossbow trap. Maybe the mirror? What's the mirror? How did those mirrors get broken? What's that all about? I don't remember that. Huh. Hmm, let's see. Hugo Punch, he probably doesn't know anything about that. Wait a minute. I don't think we have anything then. I think we need to find something else. I, I think we gotta look on the third- Because we- Remember, we haven't looked for evidence in a really long time. <laughs> this was roses, the trophies. We already talked about that. They belong to Rose, but he never used them. Um, no crossbow trap? Yeah, I was expecting that. Let's quickly- Ah, oh, shit, shit, this is a fuck- I'm dead, I'm dead! I'm gonna die. I can't even use the mirror here, it's too dark to use the mirror, no! Time to get bonked. Go this way. Go! Run! Ah, oh, shit. Okay, use the scrying mirror here. Okay. Um... It's gonna be a new evidence, right? It's, it needs to be... We need to just start looking around. I really want to go to a different floor, though, but I think we gotta have to be on the third floor. Okay, we're on the second floor, right? Oh, that is the second floor. Okay, so we need to check around on the second floor for evidence. I see. Okay. So the se I mean, fuck, but he's, he's here! This is a disaster. Let's look in these. I don't know if I already did. I probably already did. I did not coil couple wi copper wire. Maybe that's literally it. A key. And nothing else. Hotel looks impeccable, by the way. I know I've said it many times, but damn, what a nice place. Ooh, dear mom, I'm sorry for everything. Goodbye. And a ring in a box? Wait a minute. This is not the same. Oh, this is it! Yes. Okay. Check these rooms. Check these rooms. We found the area. Okay, good stuff. Man. This place is confusing. Nice. Do not use. You found a heater marked as dangerous. He got zapped by the heater. Understood. Okay. Yeah, I'm coming for you. You're super far away. Thank you for announcing your presence super far. That makes my life very easy, because then I get to check all these rooms. Uh, nice. Yeah, he was... He was zapped, or something. Another key. I wonder how much more evidence for... <laughs> compass and... Okay, wait, that's good to know, though. That 220 has a compass? Oh, don't stop doing this. 220 has a compass if we need it later. And we also had another room that had a compass as well. I don't think we can cut. Oh, he's far away. All right, go. Go take the elevator. Nice. <laughs> we need a bonk emote. There's literally a bonk emote on Twitch. Right, back to the third floor so we can talk to Harvey. Literally right here. Talk to him. Is someone there? Harvey. I can hear you. Is it Harvey? Let's see. I'm I'm pretty sure it's this. Yeah, it's Harvey. I'm br is it this Who related? did the wedding ring belong to? Probably belongs to Rose. Ooh. Who wrote the note that says goodbye? I don't know anything about that. Okay, let's try this. Maybe a couple of What was the coil of wire used for? 
Jimmy used to carry it around with him. No hmm. idea why. Okay, let's combine these. Why is there an old heater marked dangerous? He was getting electric shock. <laughs> I kept it so the police could check it. Uh huh. When you said Jimmy started setting traps for you, does that have anything to do with what you said about the dangerous heater? Jimmy was always playing with electricity. Nice. Well, he was never the one who got shocked. The shit. Okay, back to the first floor, man. We're mi we're breaking Jimmy's ankles over here, going from floor to floor to floor. He never knows what hit him. All right, I'm I'm going. Oh. <laughs> Ow. Jimmy! <laughs> Jimmy, God damn it! Oh, I can't do it in here. What the hell? Maybe. Is it Harvey? Why is it so dark in here? Yeah, it's uh, Harvey. I saw you suffering an electric shock. What happened? He knew that was my heater. He arrived the casing straight to the mains. Almost killed me. He did it deliberately. But Rose wouldn't have it. Ah. Uh. I knew he needed to be Why don't you back. kick him out of the he hotel? Aren't you the things, owner? So I decided to damage his. Oh. Uh, maybe the mirrors? But he didn't know anything about that, right? I don't remember that. Hmm. Wait, you damaged his stuff. What did, did you damage it with the cop? No. Did you damage his copper wire for some reason? I don't know why. When you said you decided to damage his property. Is that connected to what you said about the coil of wire? That doesn't make any sense. Yeah, okay. <laughs> Uh, I don't think there's anything else we have. I think we gotta find something. This is a terrible idea. I'm gonna get killed. Ooh, this is spooky, man. Oh my god, more floors for th that's huge. If we cannot, if we can keep that, aha, an ornate dagger. But that's probably doesn't have anything to do with what you did. Okay, if we can somehow survive here, go in this one. This can't be dark, right? Okay, this has got to be the room that has the item that we're looking for. What is it? It is cricket and baseball bats. You broke his cricket and baseball bats? They don't look broken at all, but I'm assuming... Okay, you sound far away. There's... Maybe it is here. Like, it's something else. Because we, we haven't checked all rooms here. Nice! Rusty keys. More evidence. Huge. Because this might very well be... You found some paintings of smoke coming out of the hotel. All these are important. Oh, and you're far away too? This is amazing. Okay, we need to get the hell out of here. And it was on the third floor, right? Where we were... We need to run to the third floor. Fuck! Oh, wait, we can go this way. Ah, this is not where we want to go. This is wrong. <laughs> ah, shit! Fuck! No, these doors are locked, goddammit! <laughs> what the hell, brother? Ah! Go, 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 go! Oh, no, he saw that for sure. Ay, 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 ay! Ay, 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 ay! Oh my god, we actually lived. I mean, maybe not. He could so he could be hiding in the bathroom or he could be um waiting for us at the door. So we ca he's in the bathroom. I don't think he I'm going out. I'm going out. And if I get bonked, then I get bonked. Bonk city, baby. <laughs> no, it's so like, well, how do you know the difference between him hiding in the bathroom and him hiding in the, <laughs> I don't know. Okay, anyway, we, we have the evidence we need. Now we, uh, let's check these rooms. Oh no, these are blocked. Wait, 
I have the key. Oh, you actually, st he steals every single key. Does that mean there's a person in here, by the way? Oh! There, wait, 303 also has a friend. Okay, 303 also has a friend. Keep it in mind. Wait, so all our friends are here as well. I forgot. So yeah, 210. Oh, yeah, I don't think you can find uh, compasses in here. All right, we're quickly going to have to find one. Okay. Uh, I don't know where it is. So we're just going to run in circles. There's a storeroom. Hope it's this one. Look through the key. Oh. Not here. He sounded very close. Oh. What? 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 Uh-oh. Ah! What the hell, brother? I was just looking for my spirit box. <laughs> Okay, well, <laughs> I've never been bonked in a storeroom like that. That was terrifying. 119, this way? Yeah, we do. Okay, that's really nice. Let's check this one again. Maybe it moved when we got bonked. Oh, what the hell? We checked this room before the last... Okay, so when you get bonked, he moves the items around. Wait, that's huge. Okay, let's go. We found it. Uh, That's amazing. Now we can finally... Where was it again? Was it on this floor? Because we have what we need. But it's literally pointing straight. Is it in this fucking room? Is it in this room? Is anyone there? I don't think so. But it's close by. It is pointing. In a specific direction. Why is it always pointing here? What the hell, man? Uh oh, shit, 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 I don't even have this one. Run, fucking go in there. Oh boy. Don't I have the key for this? No, I don't. Of course I don't. Go. Yeah, go. Oh boy. I'm gonna be so dead, man. Fuck. Maybe it's in the hall. Oh my god, he fucking knows. He fucking knows. How is he looking straight into this without bonking me? I'm gonna wait this time. I'm not gonna get out, because you killed me last time, not again. We spent like half an hour recovering from the one bonk. I'm just gonna wait until he talks. He's probably just baiting. Was that him? It was so quiet. It sounded like he was super far away. I don't know. I don't think he could get that far. Come on. How long? Goodness gracious. I don't hear him at all. Is he just sitting in the bathroom? I'm still in danger. Let's look through the people. If I get bonked, yeah! oh my god, dude. That's that's so bullshit because I spent the last my last three bonks were me assuming he was in the bathroom and just speed running past the bathroom. And as soon as I don't expect that to happen, that's literally what happens. I Three times I got punished for assuming he was in the bathroom. So I'm gonna be like, I, I was like, well, I have to assume he's not in the bathroom. And then he is in the fucking bathroom. Are you kidding me? That's so unlucky. All right. Well, because I'm pretty sure it's just a 50-50. Okay. Well, you know the drill by now. Let's find another fucking spirit box. God damn it. Oh, man. This is so frustrating. Oh, wait. It could Wait a minute. It could have literally just been here. Wait, it is literally right here. Okay, well, uh, that was way faster than last time. Okay. Uh, how are we gonna find the ghost, though? That's a real question, because I have no idea where the ghost is. 119. Here we go. Okay. This should have a compass, and then we just gotta find where the fuck Harvey's ghost is. Another scrying mirror in 119 as well, that we were correct about that. Okay. So if we need a scrying mirror later, we can go to 119. That is really good to know. Uh, now, where does one go? He can't be on this floor yet because he was literally just on the third floor, right?
What is the fucking compass point towards? It's not moving randomly. It is pointing somewhere. Is it in here? Hello? I tried this earlier and he didn't respond to me. You suck. <laughs> okay, well, anyway, whatever. Now he responded. Okay, this is what I wanted to talk about. The fucking bats. Wait. Huh? Oh, he's not here. Is it, Harvey? And he's outside. Yeah, oh, never mind. He's here. Okay. I am so confused. Okay, regardless, we've done it. What were all the crickets and baseball bats for? Okay. In case I need it. So you destroyed... You did this, right? When you said you decided to damage his property, does that have something to do with what you said about the crickets and baseball bats? I kept those bats for self-defense. Aha! Uh -huh. went smashing smashing and breaking on the second floor all right i really want to see this <laughs> okay, let's, we need to live though do not kill me jimmy okay second floor is where he's gonna smash or do we like rotate here do we rotate and get the why aren't you doing the damn cutscene brother i'm pretty sure it's supposed to be here Hide in the closet in that room? Look from the corner? I already did that, though. He Why does it trigger it? Okay, whatever. Well, we, we, we've we looked at this for... I, I guess the reloading helped. Okay, <laughs> I don't understand. Anyway, it's fine. We, we spend like five minutes trying to get this cutscene to trigger. <laughs> okay, he's just destroying stuff. Nice. All right, we've done it. So he's in here. Let's talk to him. Yeah, I don't know why that didn't work previously. And then what happens? Is it Harvey? Yeah. Hi there. I saw you with a bat coming out of a room. What had you done? I smashed up his television and games consoles and stuff. I was angry. That seems a little... <laughs> I mean, he did shock you, but that seems like a bit of a overreaction from an adult towards a child. Uh, okay. I smashed up Jimmy's television and games console. I was angry, but okay, let me guess. Now it's about the crossbow. When you said Jimmy soon retaliated, does that have anything to do with what you said about the crossbow? Jimmy was uh, with weapons like that. I hadn't seen him all night after I smashed his stuff. I should have guessed he'd been working on his next little trick. <laughs> Uh-oh. On the second floor, he's... Oh, the booby trap! Ay, 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 ay. <laughs> okay. Well, he's smashed. Okay, second floor. We're on the second floor as well right now. We just gotta be careful not to die here. It's in this room. It's in this room. It's gotta be here. And then we just need to trigger the cutscene. How do we trigger the cutscene? This way? Oh. Oh. oh, he walks... He walks away really... Really smoothly, considering he just got shot in the leg. Okay. Well, we... We're good. Is he here? Is it Harvey? Oh, okay. He's down this hallway because he walked. Oh, God. I gotta go. I can't talk to him. Harvey, please. No. Oof. Oof. Go into this room. Can I even go into this room? Oh, boy. It's a dark room. This is a disaster. Ah, oh, fuck. Ah! Help. No, I hated it. At least we know it's gonna leave now. Oh, come on, man. Don't bonk me. Do not bonk me. No bonkeroni, please. Ooh, 
okay, he might be waiting outside though now. So now we gotta be really damn careful. <laughs> oh, he's far away. Let's go. Okay. He's far away. Okay, where do go back? Just this way. I got shit to do, man. Stop. Uh, wait, can I talk to him here? Hey. No! That was the wrong button! I'm fucking stupid! Ah! I didn't mean to click the hey button. I meant to press the spirit box. Okay. He is just walk. He just literally walks past. But we're gonna wait a little bit. Alright, say. Uh, he walks backward? What the fuck? <laughs> What is happening? He's just walking back and forth in front of my door. What the fuck? <laughs> He's gonna walk backwards. I think I heard him in the distance. I'm not entirely sure. Here we go. But now where do we go? This way. Is he here? Wait, he's in the room? Wait, he's in this room, but he walked out of the room. But it, huh? Is someone there? Hello? Oh. Is it Harvey? Wait, that's so. It's so inconsistent where you have to talk to yeah, the spirits. Sometimes, so with Doctor Bose, every time he walked off the screen, we had to walk with him and talk in the next next like door over. But for this guy, we have to talk in the room itself, even though he was out of the room. It's just confusing sometimes. Uh, anyway, it's fine. Uh, he's being shot in the I leg. I see being shot in the leg with an arrow. What happened? Jimmy had set it up to fire when I opened the door. I had to go into A and D, get stitches and tetanus shots. When I got back, I couldn't find him. Rose said he was hiding in the basement. Uh -huh. I gave me an idea. What is this about, was by the way? Was there a fire at the hotel? Yeah. They managed to contain it, but I lost a lot of stuff. A lot of stuff. What is about the... Who does the dagger belong to? It's not a dagger. It's a letter open. It's not supposed to be sharp. Uh, so did you use this on him or something? I don't know why, you but... You thought Jimmy would like hiding or do you basement? lock him in the basement, Does maybe? Does that have anything to do with what with you think the keys. about the dagger? Oh, I think it's gonna be this. What are those rusty old keys for? For the basement door. That was the old boiler room door. Yes! Let me guess you locked him in there, huh? When you said you thought Jimmy would like hiding in the basement... Does that have something to do with those rusty keys? Michelle, thank you for the five gift subs. Well, if Jimmy wants Aha. to go down there, I thought he must like it. I see. Let's go. We're going to the basement. Oh boy, I feel like this story is reaching its conclusion soon. <clears throat> Let's hope we don't get killed. Okay, save the game. So now we just need to safely make it down to the basement without getting bonked. Which shouldn't be too hard, but Jimmy's been an absolute piece of work. Okay. Linex, thank you for the 10, and Lila, thank you for the 9. <laughs> what the fuck am I supposed to do? I look through the people for so long, and then he kills me anyway. <laughs> Alright, you piece of shit. Okay, well, we immediately found the spirit box. Man, this spawn is crazy. Okay, well, I don't think we really need a compass here because it's in the basement, right? And there's only like two spots in the basement. So I think we can just go to the basement and talk to him. I don't think we need a compass here. Okay, here we are. Now, let's see. It's gotta be the boiler room. Oh, there we go. You can stay in there for the night, Jimmy. <laughs> I'm ready to go. Uh-oh. I think Jimmy's gonna do some bad shit in the boiler room. Uh-oh. <laughs> He's gonna have some fun in there. Hello? Is someone there? Harvey? 
Wait, did, are you in the elevator? Can we even talk in the elevator? Or are you in this room? Is, are we going to talk to Jimmy? Who's there? Wait, huh? Wait, we, there's no way we can use the thing in the elevator, can we? I don't remember being able to. I think you just got to click a button here, but maybe. Yeah. Uh, I guess we go to the to the ground floor and then we talk over there. Capitao, thank you for the two months. Where the hell was? He? Is he here? At the reception, probably. Is someone there? I can hear you. Okay, nice. Here. Is it Harvey? Yeah, it's Harvey. I saw you locking Jimmy in the basement. What happened? I wanted to give Jimmy a dose of his own medicine. I thought he couldn't do any damage down there. I was wrong. <laughs> well, how about uh, this? The fire. You said you were wrong to think Jimmy couldn't do any damage in the basement. Is that connected to what you said about the fire in the hotel? <laughs> Why would he make a fire when he's in that room? How did he survive that? Uh oh. Wait, what? That did not really show me where it was. We didn't start the fire. We truly didn't. Wait, is it in the. Are we going back? We're probably going back to the basement, I would assume. And then he's gonna like knock on the door like Jimmy, what are you doing in there? You're you're starting a freaking fire, brother. Isn't he gonna Did Jimmy die? Is Jimmy a ghost? Have we been being bonked by ghost? Oh. You're gonna get killed, you stupid idiot. Open the door. Um <laughs> That's so cool, dude. This game is awesome. Well, hi, are you here? Is it Harvey? Hello? Oh, I can hear you. He's too distant. Is he in the boiler room this time? Where is he? Is it Harvey? Yeah. Okay, Harvey. he's in the boiler room. I saw a fire in the basement. What happened to the hotel? Uh-oh. We managed to contain it before it got out of hand. Is this how Harvey died? Uh oh. I wanted him gone? Well, does that have anything to do with this? Did you stab him? When you said you wanted Jimmy gone, does that have anything to do with what you said about the dagger? Oh, no? Wait, what? How is he gonna get Jimmy gone? Hmm. Uh. The copper wire? Jimmy used to carry it around with it. Why would that. Oh, the goodbye note, maybe? Wait, what? Maybe the goodbye note. Or the suitcases, maybe? Maybe he threw the suitcases out? Maybe? Let's see. The suitcases were super long ago. Uh, we managed to contain. I wanted him when gone. You said you wanted Jimmy gone. Is that connected to what you said about the suitcase? I feel like we got this. Ah, shit. Um... Sure, check it out. What is the item? It's another mirror in 214? Ah, you found an old gun. Okay, we never checked 214. Okay, there we go. We found the gun. Now we need to go back to the fucking basement and talk to him about the gun. He's literally here. Go. Woo! Oh, there he is. <laughs> okay, nice. Anyway, we, we take in the elevator. What? How did he die? Because we're talking to ghosts here, right? And the ghost died to Jimmy. Did Jimmy take the gun and shoot you somehow? How did a child overpower you with a gun? I don't understand. That doesn't make any sense. Is anyone there? He's here, right? I can hear you. Is yeah. it Harvey? 
Or should they give her the yeah, nine? Probably. Okay. Who does the gun belong to? You, probably. It was mine. Okay. When you said you wanted Jimmy gone, does that have something to do with what you said about the gun? I'd lost it. I've seen Red. I hated him. I lost control. Uh-oh. What if he gotta go to the second floor? Man, this guy is sending us all over the fucking shop, man. Okay, second floor. We also have a compass, so this is good. Going down the hall and walking back. Why did it point Get straight to the hotel, Jimmy? Okay. It's fine. Oh That's so annoying. This is my hotel. Get Such fake hotel, blood. Jimmy. That that freaking compass arrow was baiting us so hard. Holy. The compass was pointing straight into that room, even though it wasn't there at all. Anyway, we found him. Is it Harvey? <laughs> yes. Hi. I saw you with a gun, practicing with it. What were you going to do? I don't know what I was going to do. Threaten him, get him out of the hotel, problem was. I didn't realize he was going to be on too. With the dagger! Here we go. Boom. When you said you didn't realize Jim would be armed too, does that have anything to do with what you said about the dagger? How did you win? How did you lose? It wasn't even a dagger. I never learned my lesson. Jimmy was always one step ahead of me. Oh boy. Where is this? Where was that? That's gotta be in the downstairs area, right? Okay. Man. F. Harvey is gonna get stabbed. We're almost there. Knife to a gunfight and he somehow won. What a maniac. All right, follow the exit. We gotta go. <laughs> what the hell, brother? <laughs> okay, well, rip me then. Holy, that got me out of nowhere. <laughs> okay, but we're on the first floor. This is amazing. The first floor is so easy to find. Why can't I go this way? Uh, excuse me? Why can't I go down this hallway? What? <laughs> um, huh? It's bugged. It's bugged again. What? I'm so confused. We can easily find the spirit box here, though. I don't know why we're having so many bugs. I mean, I guess it was... Yeah, now I can go this way. Uh, I was not having any bugs on my first playthrough. I don't remember this. Oh, nice! Okay, well, actually, that helped, because now... Here we go. We got him. All right, spirit box acquired. Um, let's go. Now we need to go to probably the the ground floor. I would guess we're sure literally right next to it. Yeah, we've been bonked quite a few times, huh? Okay, well we don't have a compass, but I think I rem. Oh, there he is. <laughs> Smiled. All right, well that was easy. Thank you. Is it down here? Where are you? Jimmy? Jimmy? This way? Aha! Uh -huh. You gonna be a cutscene? Oh. Oh. oh my god! He got fucking murdered! <laughs> oh goodness gracious, I was not expecting that. <laughs> <laughs> this game is brutal. <laughs> is it Harvey? Yeah, it's Harvey. Well, uh, Rip. I saw you being stabbed backstage. What happened? Jimmy crept up behind me. I didn't see him. Jimmy always won in the end. I. <laughs> wow. Rip. How did he not just kick him out of the hotel? Isn't he the... Also, that's Hugo Punch! So now we need to talk to Hugo Punch. Which is in... This is the third floor, right? I think that's the third floor. I'm pretty sure that's the third floor. We need to write that down. We have completed 
Harvey's story. Oh boy, here we go. Well, it's the next day for us, but same day for you guys. Uh, we're gonna be uh continuing the story now we made notes on what we had to do so let's remind ourselves uh 106 and 119 we have mirrors uh and we need to go to the third floor so let's go to the third floor right away that's where we're gonna find we don't have a compass oh we would love to find a compass as well uh because that's where we're gonna find the next ghost which is gonna be related to hugo punch because at the end of last stream we finished we did amy's story we did dr bose's story and we did harvey's story uh now we are gonna do i don't even remember i think the i think rose has a story if i remember correctly um and i don't know who else so we're gonna find out and then you also need to save your friends 208 all right good stuff we find a compass in here and then we should be good thank you Let, oh, let's hope there's another one so we can write this down there is not another one. Okay. Do we have a compass, though? Can't be here, right? Wait, it's literally here. Is it through the people? Nope. Gonna be in this room, or is it gonna be looking... Oh, fuck. Let's look around. What are we gonna see here? Get ready to be jump scared? It's so specific how you have to trigger the cutscene. It's so annoying. <laughs> have we checked in here? There's the broken mirrors. How do we trigger this cutscene? We know it's going to be here. Maybe through the peephole. Or maybe looking back from this angle. Okay, nothing looking through this. This is one 301. So if we get bonked, we can go back to 301. It's right in front. How the fuck? It's it's looking this way. How do I trigger this cutscene? Yeah! Ah! <laughs> it's so annoying. I I've looked. <laughs> I was outside of the room spinning in circles. Inside of the room spinning in circles. Where are the fucking cutscenes? It's so annoying. <laughs> like, that's the one thing that definitely doesn't age well in terms of gameplay for me. That the cutscenes are just so, like, so... Uh, hard to trigger sometimes that you get yourself into a bad situation to like try and get the story to happen and it kind of feels like you're just being robbed by the game all right well all we need we know it's at 301 all we need is a spirit box and then we can go back to 301 but i definitely feel like i got robbed there how do i trigger this cutscene i'm looking at this no cutscene is triggering so i gotta go there so then how do i trigger the cutscene here do I just look at this door? Do I look at this? I don't see a cutscene. Nothing is happening. Okay, I guess we gotta go in here. But I literally, sp like, spun in circles here over and over, and I didn't get any cutscene to spawn. So I don't know how. Keyhole? I already looked through the keyhole before, and it didn't do anything. Um, is it in the bathroom? Oh my, it's in the bathroom?! Okay, we found it. What the hell? Uh oh. What the heck? Abuse? Uh, I'm assuming that has to do with the uh, with the mirrors here. Are we just in the bathroom now? We are on the floor in the bathroom. Can we talk to you? Is anyone there? No? What? Not even a vague response? Excuse me? <laughs> Wait, what? <laughs> Is anyone there? Huh? Amy didn't have an answer. Wait, huh? I was not... Why are you not responding to me? Are you- can I- I can't talk in the bathroom, right? You gotta have mega patience. Okay, let's see. Where are we supposed to go? We are supposed to go... Rose, I know. Hello, Rose. Is this gonna be- please tell me it's ground floor or basement. That would be incredible. I doubt it, but that would be awesome. It's on the second floor, which is not where we just were. Does that mean Jimmy's on the second floor? We literally just were on the first floor. 
Uh, Alexander, thank you for the 10 gift subs. Thank you. Okay, we're going to the second floor. It's in front of the elevator. So do we talk here? Harvey was going to oh, shoot Oh, hi you. there. It was just a letter opener. It was self-defense. Look. Okay, we found her. Let's go. Hello? Are you here? Okay, you're too far. You're this way. Are you? Hello? Talk to me. Oh, fucking what? Where do I gotta go, brother? No! I'm gonna die. I'm gonna die. I don't know what I just saw. I don't know what I just saw, but there was something there. Oh, go in here. Fucking what the hell? Hide. Hide! Okay. Okay. <laughs> I... I am not leaving this closet until fucking kingdom come, dude. I'm gonna sit here until I like for the next 10 minutes until I hear you far away. I am not trying any funny business. I've tried too much funny business and has led to my death every single time. No more funny business. That was my day. I went to Oppenheimer. I haven't been to the movies in like four years. Um and I miss the like the movie trance. Where you like come out of the movie theater and you're like, wait a minute, the day's still going? I thought I was going to bed. I'm so fucking exhausted <laughs> from all the mental energy I just spent on paying attention to this movie. But Oppenheimer is very, uh, you have to pay very close attention all the time. They, they're like talking about a hundred different people. There's like 70 names you have to keep track of. It's fucking crazy. Did I like the movie? It was amazing. Uh, actually... <laughs> You know the one thing that's unforgivable? I don't know how this happened. I don't know how this happened, given it was like a hundred plus million dollar production, but there is such an uh, such a blatant, like, embarrassing mistake in the movie where they go to Leiden, which is a Dutch city, and then Oppenheimer is giving a lecture, and there's like an ignorant American uh, student that's like talking to a Dutch person, like, Oh, because because Oppenheimer's American, right? And he knows that. So he's like, if you have trouble with the English, I can help you. And Oppenheimer hears that. So he's like, fuck you, piece of shit, American. I'm going to talk in Dutch. And then he proceeds to talk in German <laughs> for the next 10 seconds. And my my mouth hit the floor when they did that. I was like, are you kidding me? A freaking hunt like Christopher Nolan movie, 200 million dollars spent and they couldn't fact check the German d being Dutch. Like, what the hell? And then they and then that scene was over and they were sitting in the train car and he was talking to some general like, when did you learn Dutch? How do you speak Dutch so well? And he was just like, yeah, I learned it. Uh, what the fuck? <laughs> like, what the hell, brother? That is so stupid. Like, was there not a single Dutch person involved in the entire production to be like, uh, that's not actually correct? Like, there was no one at all who was like, hey, Nolan, uh, this is not correct. So we've been sitting here for five minutes at least and he has not make a single noise he should be in the bathroom you have to get out fast do not look at the bathroom just sprint past it i'll do it but if i die i'm done with this game here we go 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 run i am going the wrong way i'm going in here now apparently no not that door but this oh wait no we can go through here this is the mannequin room, and then we can just loop around. Okay, I lived. I lived, bitch. Eat shit, but I'm still in danger mode. Okay, now I'm no longer in danger mode. Nice. All right, I, I guess he was in the bathroom there. I did not have the key, so I couldn't lock him in, sadly. Uh, but that's fine. Okay, so we're trying to talk to this lady. But the lady is nowhere to be found. It should be, it should be at this place, right? Here? Right here. 
Is anyone there? It's too far away. Okay, but it is here somewhere. Is it here? Is anyone there? It's further away. What? Is it in this room here? Is it in this? Is it in the storeroom? It's in front of the. Is someone there? Oh my god. It's gotta be in the storeroom. So otherwise, it doesn't ma make any sense. Is it in here? Are you in here, Rose? Please talk to me. Is someone there? There we go. Why is it in the storage room? You walked away from the storage room. This is the least. Okay, it's fine. Don't get mad. This this, this game name? just sometimes doesn't make any sense at all. <laughs> like you can literally see it in this picture that she walked this way. Okay. Wait, did you're the ho wait? You own the hotel? That's why they couldn't kick her out. I see. Cookies, thank you for the five. I saw a lady explaining that the dagger was a letter opener. Who was she? Ah, interesting. It was me. Aha. Uh -huh. I mean, to a certain degree, definitely. Or. What? Okay, I thought we were gonna have a little bit more of a chat there. We can't even talk to you about anything else. Uh, alright, well, that's gonna be at the front door, right? I don't... Yes! Yes, we were totally right. Look at that. Okay, so it is here. Look. It's gonna be there. It is not there. It's at this door. No, it's not blinking. Is it... Do I have to look around? Here we go. Nice. Jimmy. Oh. Oh, uh, hi, skeleton lady. <laughs> Hello? Is it Rose? Yes. Yes. Who are you greeting at the entrance in reception? Uh oh. Let me guess this. Uh, where is it? This evidence is so old. The this. Who is Hugo Punch? It was Jimmy's comedy act. Jimmy was I wanna. It, what I wanna talk about this? With newspaper articles in it. Who made it? I don't remember. And what about the crossbow? Where's the crossbow from? <laughs> okay. How did those mirrors get broken? Jimmy broke them. Jimmy broke them? Wait, what? What about this whole thing? I heard a man shouting at someone, telling them to do as he says. Who was he? I never knew what he wanted. There was only one thing I could give him. Uh, what? I never knew what he wanted. There's only one thing I could give him? What about this? I saw Harvey being stabbed backstage. <laughs> what happened? Harvey had gone mad. Jimmy was just defending himself. Uh-huh. How about this? Who did the wedding ring belong to? It was mine. Someone made me an offer I couldn't refuse. <laughs> <laughs> Fucking Don Corleone over here, excuse me. <laughs> I saw someone on stage, a performer, announcing himself as the great Hugo. He was a magician and an entertainer. He bought the hotel to promote his stage show. He became famous. <clears throat> he was on television. I worked as his assistant. Then things 
Okay. Wait, what? You, wait, is there two different purse people? Hugo was a magician and an entertainer. He bought the hotel to promote his stage show. He became famous. I worked as... Oh, wait. How about this? When you said things developed with Hugo, is that connected to the wedding ring? Ah, let's go. We were, we were happy at first. Before things started to change. Okay. And then the man shot. I never knew what he wanted. There's only one thing I could give him. What is that about? There's only one thing I could give him. Wait, so Jimmy broke the mirror? What about this, by the way? I saw Dr. Bose tying a rope around his neck. Oh no, don't he say it. Blah, 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 blah. Why? Oh, she just doesn't say anything. <laughs> Excuse me, they just didn't... They didn't expect you to ever talk about that. They didn't even have, like, I don't know. <laughs> She's just complete silent. Who wrote the note that says goodbye? Wait, what? Is it? Is the ghost broken? You said there was only one thing you could give oh. Hugo. Is that connected to the wedding ring? What? Huh? <laughs> Excuse me, ghost. Could you please talk to me? What's going on? <laughs> Wait, in contact with Rose Hotel proprietor. Uh, she roamed? Should the ghost room changed? What's going on here? Uh, hello? Hello? I saw Harvey heading towards the ballroom with a gun. I think I might have to what reload. She's giving me the cold shoulder. I think she, I I think I might wait a while before trying to make contact again. What do you mean? I was trying to. Huh? We were just having a conversation and she just stopped talking to me entirely. What the fuck? Hello. Oh, here we go. All right. I don't know what happened with Rose. Yes, there we go. All right. I wasn't done talking with you. Excuse me, lady. Uh, I was trying to talk to you about. Well, it doesn't really matter. Let's see. Uh, how about the dagger? Who does the dagger belong to? It was a letter opener. It was a present from someone. Okay, it was a present from someone. And what about the was fire? Was there a fire at the hotel? Yes. But we caught it in time. And Jimmy did it. Okay, and how about this? Who wrote the note that says goodbye? And the, the suitcases? Me wrote it, and what about these two things? We, there's so much Each evidence we had collected that we never used. Oh, I see. I so she also trip. died, of Who course, by the way. What the hell? <laughs> What a hell? Okay, uh, let's see. So what are we trying to do? We have- we have these. We need to make connections between these. I never knew what he wanted. There was only one thing I could give him. Hmm. How do we- what do we pair that with? What could she give him? The keys? What are those rusty old keys for? They were to the boiler room. I try- oh, I guess I could try Redding Ring again. We had to have the door replaced. Okay, let's start. Let's ask the wedding ring again. Maybe that's the same. Uh, this combination. You said there was only one thing you could give Hugo. Is that connected to the wedding ring? She doesn't know. Okay, uh, that's not it. And what is with these mirrors? Jimmy broke the mirrors. Uh, was that? A, has that? There was only one thing I could give to him. You give him a baby? <laughs> is that what's going on here? I'm confused. <laughs> what is with these? What was the coil of wire used for? Jimmy used to carry wire around with him. He liked playing around with electronics. Okay then. Uh Do you realize that your child killed like laid people and stuff? Uh, okay. Well, there was a fire. Hmm. What do we need? How do we do this? Oh, yeah. Wait, wait, no. Wait, we need to combine this with this. We completely forgot about this and combining this. I thought I already did that, but I didn't do it. I need to combine that plus the... this one. 
when you said Jimmy found a way of bringing in more guests. Is that connected to what you said about the Hugo Punch? That's got to be correct, right? Yes. There. That was Jimmy Okay. He was a comedian. He was good. Really good. <laughs> People started to come just to watch him. Are you sure? Oh. What is that? What was that? There was something in the background. It looked like one of the storerooms. Okay, but we got two sightings on her. Uh, we still need to connect this one and this one uh, with something that we don't know yet. Was it the stage? It maybe was. Oh, it was backstage. Backstage, probably. I can hear the music here as well. Aha. Uh -huh. We're smart. Look this way. Ladies and gentlemen, please welcome to the stage your entertainment for this evening, Mr. Hugo Punch. That's so silly. <laughs> what the fuck? Okay. Can we talk? Is it Rose? Yes. Hi there. She sounds like she's not happy about it. I saw you announcing Hugo Punch onto the stage. I was enjoying it. We were making money again. Everything seemed to be getting better until Jimmy started behaving oddly. Uh oh. Seemed angry. Is this combined with the mirrors? Because he broke stuff, right? Wait, the mirrors are. Wait, where the hell are the mirrors? Oh, they're all the way over here. What you said about Jimmy staring at himself and becoming angry. Is that connected to what you said about the broken mirrors? Nice. Okay, we're doing it. We're actually going sickle mode right now. Uh, that is the third floor. Very close to the stairs. Okay. Nice. Jimmy. Oh yeah, this thing. This is what we saw in the th in the um in the vision. So I'm assuming we just go to the third floor. Easy peasy. It's this way. Oh, hide. Okay, well, time to die again. It's gotta be around here somewhere. Yeah, it's really nice when the story continues where Jimmy can't be. There he is! Hey, friend! <laughs> it's so silly. Talk to me! He sounds so close. All right. Whatever, we we waited for so long. Let's just yell at him and do a hiding mini game and then probably fail, hey. but whatever. He's literally right here. Hide. He's right in front of the door. There he comes. Okay, but I was already hiding in the bath or in the wardrobe. Okay, so this is a situation where he's either in the bathroom or he's outside baiting me. And we we know that we can figure out by just waiting for a little while to see if he talks. Because if he doesn't talk, he's in the bathroom. That sounds far away. I'm just going. Like, at this point, is it even worth it? If we get bonked, whatever. We don't even have a compass. We've been sitting in this room for the last ah! 10 minutes. Like, what are you supposed to do? That was genuinely 10 minutes of just waiting, doing absolutely nothing. And we go outside and we immediately... So you literally... The game was expecting me to wait for even longer. That is so dumb. <laughs> that is so dumb. <laughs> Can we see this? Oh, whoops. All of a sudden, we're 80% completed. Oh, hi there. <laughs> what the hell? Nice. Mannequins. 
Okay, well, we don't have a spirit box because we literally just got bonked. So we're going to have to find... Okay, so which room are we at? We're at 306. Okay, let's quickly find the spirit box and get back to 306. Okay, talk to her here. Hello? Is there? Oh, she's close. She's far Let me guess, now we do have to go this way? Okay, it's got to be in this room or whatever. I don't know. Oh, this room doesn't even open. It's in this dark ass room. Who's there? I can hear you. Oh! <laughs> okay, it's, it's fine. It's fine. It doesn't make any sense that it's in this room, but it is, and it's okay. <laughs> Holy shit, I'm actually like so mad. Uh, wait, huh? Is it Rose? Is it Rose? So fucking annoying. I saw you standing in a corridor full of mannequins. Who put them there? Jimmy. I didn't understand at first. I was confused. But then I realized Jimmy wasn't the one doing these things. It was. Okay, he tears up his thing. This is yes downstairs. We can get the hell out of here. Nice. Okay. Well, we're obviously going to get bonked along the way, but I don't really care. Just bonk me. We're going to find another spirit box. It doesn't really matter. Um, we're going to try and run, run out of here. Get ready for the show. Is it in the middle? Okay. Where, where do we got to look? Oh! It's just his comedy routine. <laughs> okay. It's his sense of humor. Oh, I'm sorry if you've been offended. Mm. Excuse me. Alrighty then. That that got me good. I was not nice? expecting that at all. Yes, Alright, Rose. Um I saw you in the ballroom. The audience was booing and you were apologizing. What was happening? He should become a Twitch streamer. <laughs> Uh-oh. <laughs> Dude, he, he was born too early. He did something stupid. It wasn't Jimmy on stage anymore. It was Hugo and she started insulting his audience every night after the show. A guest told Jimmy what she thought of him. He lost his temper and did something stupid. What was that? Did he kill someone with... The dagger? This and the wire? When you said Jimmy lost his temper and did something stupid, is that connected to what you said about the coil of wire? Jimmy locked her in what? I didn't know what he was going to do. I found her and let her go. Jimmy said it was a joke. Jimmy was Oh, wait, he tied her up with the wire. What? Okay. I was like, how is this in any way connected? And what the hell is that unhinged reaction, by the way? Holy shit. Okay, well, it's here again. This is very convenient that it's all so close together, so we don't have to be in... Uh... Oh. It's upscared. This way? Where is it? Oh, hi there. Okay. <laughs> okay, I see. Uh, are you going to be in front of this door over here? Is it Rose? Probably going to be further down. Vaguely here. That means she's... I think she... We can't go in here, though. Are you here? Is it Rose? Oh, never mind. You are here. Okay. I saw you upset. People were knocking on the door asking questions. Who were they? Yeah, so he needs to be locked up. This seems dangerous. Ah, 
Ah, does this have something to do with the goodbye note that we found like literally when hours and hours Jimmy ago? To leave everything behind and go, is that connected to the goodbye note? I would assume. Jimmy hated what he'd done. Okay. He'd been fighting Hugo Punch all his life. It was inside him, making him do all those bad things. Jimmy didn't want to live anymore. Uh oh. Yeah, he already killed so many people. Second floor. In front, right at the stairs? Okay, second floor, nice. Oh, we're getting closer. It's in this room, whoops. Oh no, it's out here. Oh, it's there. It came from 223. Is it this room? Bathroom? Hide in the bathroom. Oh, nothing in here either. Hmm. Can we talk to you here? The ghost is closed. Go inside this room. Oh, there we go. Okay, nice. <laughs> Damn, the acting is pretty damn good. Yes. I'm Rose. What happened? I saw you in a room upstairs. It looked like you found someone in the bathroom. Uh-oh. What happened? It was Jimmy. He tried to kill uh -oh. himself. That's why I had to tell him the truth. That's why I had to tell him the truth. The truth was that you were leaving? Is that the truth? Did we have so many things? When you said you had to tell Jimmy the truth, is that connected to what you said about the suitcases? No, wait, what? I was... The ring? Hmm, I think we might have to look around for more. Didn't I ever look in this? Why didn't I not look while I was here? Oh, there you go. I just never, never looked. All right, good stuff. We got what we need. Now we just need to make it out of here alive. So the baby toy. Okay. Starting to get somewhat slightly familiar with these room layouts. And then here we talk to you. Is anyone there? Is it Rose, maybe? I can hear you. Hello? Is it Rose? And then we combine these two. Who did the baby's rattle belong to? It was for the baby. I kept it in my bedside drawer. Yeah. When you said you had to tell Jimmy the truth, does that have something to do with the baby's rattle? I don't know. What? <laughs> Wait, what? <laughs> What? I'm so confused. Wait, how is that not connected? Is that for this? You said there was only one thing you could give Hugo. Does that have something to do with the baby's rattle? Oh, here we go. Okay. Oh, okay. That's it. Baby doesn't solve anything. Okay. So, we can't combine these with anything else. So now we gotta look at the scrying mirror again. And, oh. And see the next evidence, I guess. I, wait, we really missed this much evidence? I thought we had so much. Okay. This is the third floor again. Very close. Wait, no, it's the ground floor. Wait, what? You spin my head. Right round. Right round. Do I need to look at the elevator? Nope. Come on. Go in the elevator? Oh, yep. There you go. <laughs> uh oh. Whoa. 
What the fuck? Okay, then. She's not gonna be here, though. Do we gotta go back to the... To the... 223 and talk to her? Oh, wait! Wait, there's a key! Excuse me? Basement store! Dun dun dun! Well, I don't know why I left that, because we gotta go to the basement. Okay! We found a key. Special key. We're also in, like, according to the stats, like, if you look at the completion, we are, like, basically there. We were at, like, 93% completion or something, right? Let's look. Yeah, we're at 93% completion. Is it this room? Try door. It's locked, but how about this key? You unlock the door. Oh, mannequins. I don't like it here. Um, what's this? Search here? A uh, birth certificate. Yes. Okay. That thing is hit. Wait, we need to... Can we inspect this? Wait, I can't. Can we inspect the birth certificate? It was zoomed in for a second. Okay. Uh, we're gonna obviously have to talk to her about that. Let's go... Okay, nice. Luckily, I, s I actually know where this room is now. Is anyone there? Here it comes. Hello? Is it, is it Rose? Rose? Yeah. I want to talk to you about this. Can I talk to you about this? I heard a man shouting and a child crying. What happened? Uh, okay. We combine I this. I found Jimmy's birth certificate. It says Hugo Hall is Jimmy's real father. Jimmy is Hugo's son. Yeah? In every way. Okay. <laughs> what the fuck? <laughs> Alright, uh, is that gonna be combined with this? When you said you had to tell Jimmy the truth, does that have something to do with what you said about Jimmy's birth certificate? Ah, because I left them. Hugo beat Jimmy from when he was born. For two years. Damn. What the hell? Okay. So it is the, the outcome that was the most likely. Back to the basement we go. Okay. Now we just have to make it to the basement. How, how does that... 96% complete? We're insane. I'm just going. If I get bonked, so be it. We know exactly where this is. Here it is. It's this room, right? Isn't it? Oh, nope, it's not. I thought it was that room. What? Do we look this way? The bonking, the beginning of the bonk. Is it oh. Rose? Rose bonked. Get him, Rose. Yes. Oh. I'm Rose. What happened here? I saw you with a wooden bat. The bonk of eighty-seven. Who was it? Damn, you go. Yep. I let him abuse Jimmy for too long. It was my fault Jimmy turned out the way he did. I thought the guilt would go away if I told Jimmy. I was wrong. It made it worse. I couldn't accept what I'd done. I couldn't live with myself. Uh oh. Uh, I buried Hugo in the basement. Okay, let's see. What do we combine this with? Rose attacking. You couldn't accept what you've done. Does that mean you left? Finally, is it, are we finally going to be able to use these suitcases that we found at the very beginning of the damn game, or what now? When you said you couldn't live with yourself, 
Is that connected to what you said about the suitcases? Okay, she doesn't know. Um, hmm. I found a bottle of turpentine in the lighter. What were they for? I don't know. Ah, uh, what? Wait, huh? You don't know, but it did look like the exact same thing. When you said you couldn't live with yourself, does that have something to do with what you said about the turpentine and lighter? I had no choice. Oh, there you go. Man, that's a hard one. <laughs> Second floor, shit's gonna go down. Ay ay ay. Well, here we go, back into Jimmy territory. Do we look this way? Come on, give me the fucking cutscene! I'm gonna get bugged! It's gotta be here, right? I mean, like, I, oh, finally, holy shit, that took so long, Jesus Christ, goodness gracious, okay, look at the, look at this door and then look left, you said, there we go, what the hell okay sorry sorry that that was not as impactful to us as it was to you because we just spent the last i don't even know how long waiting <laughs> is it rose oh yes. goodness gracious i saw you you were on fire what happened <laughs> i saw you you were on fire <laughs> Completed the story. Feels bad, man. Rose, no. He did it. Her story is complete, right? Wait. No. Talking to the dead, Maya. I know Hugo's your father, Jimmy. I found your birth certificate, and I know Rose tried to kill him. But she failed, didn't she? Then where is he now? <laughs> <laughs> well, why don't you come and meet him? It's time I introduce you to the family, Maya. <laughs> oh, baby, here we go. You completed Rose's story. Wait, look at the menu. 100% complete. But not. No, not really. We're still here. Do we got to go downstairs? Probably. Uh, this way? Yes. I'm assuming we gotta go now. So is this spooky bread time? <laughs> Wait, it's here. This door is different. New door. Tell us a show delay. Burning down the halls for centuries, clearing the way, lighting the darkness, laying waste to the old and the poor and the weak. And it's burning in you too, Maya. I can tell we are destined to be together, you and I. You're the one I've been waiting for. Which is why I can't let you leave. You're oh. staying here with me, Maya. Forever. Uh, no 
thank you. Uh oh. Found five deadlock keys. You have five friends to rescue. Here we go. Okay. We have five friends to rescue. This is it. This part's gonna take like five hours because it's on extreme mode. <laughs> Do we? Can we just check the keys? Let's see. The game will save here for the last time. Oh, no. <laughs> Get ready. You now have to rescue your friends, but if Jimmy catches you, it's game over. Oh, no. Okay, here we go. Which keys do we have? We have three, 111. Let's do 111 and 115 first. 111 and 115, which are both on this side. Okay, here we go. 111, 115, they're obviously further down the hallway. At least we got a little bit more familiar with this. I think we gotta, I think this is gonna be lead to, yeah, I think we're going the right way. It's gonna, this one? No, that's here. Wait, wasn't it 110 as well? Open the door. Wait, open the damn door, 111. I don't like the clock sound. Door unlocked, here we go, friend. Hi there. What did you say? I didn't hear shit. Okay. Uh, oh God, we need to look through the people. But he doesn't seem like he's gonna be here, right? I'm just going. If we die now, whatever. <laughs> Get to the elevator as quickly as you can. We have to just do it over, right? If we die. Okay, wait for the... Did he just get killed? Did he just- did she just get killed? <laughs> Is she dead? Wait! I think I gotta wait? I think she got killed. I- I- I should've waited there. Wait, well, let me run it back real quick. <laughs> I, sh I think I should've waited. I- I shouldn't have sent her early. I think- is there a multiple ending or is there only one ending? Wait, you're telling me there's no other ending? There's no other thing you can do? You just gotta send them out? Well- here we go again then get ready to be sent to get bonked i guess it helps you to to know how close he is there is only one ending okay so then we don't have to reset okay good stuff we just sent them out there bye <laughs> here you go lady have fun get to the elevator as quickly as you can oh no scream that means he's nowhere near. Okay, away we can go. Nice. There was no scream. Okay. Ah! What the fuck, brother? He's right there. <laughs> Run. Wait, I can lock this room now. Wait, what if I deadlock him? Wait, go, go, go. What if I lock him in this room? Please go into the bathroom. Please go into the bathroom so I can lock him in here. Come on. Please. No, you suck. <laughs> okay, wait, but we can test this, right? You can't lock him in in this stage. Okay, so what we can do, I think... I'm gonna try this because I don't want to wait every time. If we leave this closet and our red, our, our menu is still red, or is it red? The menu might be red the whole time. No. Oh. Yeah, okay, never mind. He's far. He's actually far away. Let's go. Uh, and then we need to go to 15 somehow. I don't know where even 15 is. I thought this was gonna be 15 here. Uh, oh boy. Where's he at? Is it this way? Gotta be this way. Yes. All the way at the back. 14. 15. Here we go. Another friend. Open the door. Get the hell in there. Nice. Okay. Second friend. We're doing it. You okay? It's, okay. it's literally the exact same person. <laughs> it's literally... No, it's not. I don't think it is. Get to the stairs as quickly as you can. Ha <laughs> ha. 
I don't think it matters for... <laughs> well, different pants. Well, rip that one. <laughs> Minus one. Minus one friend. <laughs> Apparently, it doesn't matter. Which is very important to know, because otherwise we would just have to, like, reset over and over again until th there's no screams. We're actually crazy. Oh! He's far away! Let's go! That was actually super fast. Okay. We need to go to 2-9 and 2-10. Yes. Don't be here. No! You stinker! It's fine, because at least we know he's here. And I... Oh, this is going to be a dark room. Ah, oh, shit. Ah, oh, shit. Ah, oh, shit. What have I done? Oh, no. Oh, there we go. He's far. Okay, nice. Nice. Go, go, go. Please don't be here again. I just want to leave. Okay. Not here. Go to the elevator. Go, go, go. Even if he's here, we can go. Nice. All right. First floor complete. We might have to do this many times, but at least we did it. <laughs> okay. And now we go second floor. Because here we need to go to... Oh, boy. Hi there. We need to go to 209 and 210, which are right next to each other, which is amazing. I mean, we might have to wait a lot in those rooms, but we remember these. Uh, it's this way. Uh, it was... Oh, am I going too far? No. This way, maybe? It was with the mannequins. Yeah, here. Okay. Oh, the... No. Wait, what? Ah, shit. Wait, I'm too far. Fuck. Don't bonk me. No bonkers, please. This way, yes. Oh, the stress. Yes. Here we go. Open the door. 209. And get in. Okay. That's one more. We just have two more friends after this one. We can do this. Are we going to do this first try? No way. <laughs> okay. This is definitely a different person. <laughs> I love how they don't say anything. They're just like, what the hell? All right. Well, here you go. Wait. Huh? I didn't send them out. Just sent them. Whatever. Get to the elevator as quickly as you can. Oh, no. Ah! <laughs> I'm gonna go my friends killed. <laughs> well, rib. This is so fucked up. You gotta wait. It apparently doesn't matter. Rip friend again. Another one bites the dust. Two friends traumatized so far. Exactly. Oh, yep, it sure was close. Oh, I'm glad I didn't try. Whew. <laughs> I love that, dude. He just goes, woo, woo. <laughs> it's just fucking faces back and forth. Oh, man. <laughs> Are you fucking kidding me, dude? Can you fuck off, sir? You're still here. Are you serious? <laughs> this is so stupid. Like, what is this shit, dude? <laughs> I just have to wait for so fucking long. He's far! Finally! He's far away. Okay. Holy shit, that took so long. All right, here we go. Go. Oh, uh, wait, it's not this way. Is it this way? Wait, no, it is that way. Fuck. Go. It's this way. Unlock the door. Yes. 210. Go in. Nice. All right, another friend. Here we go. We've done it. Get ready to wait here for another 10 minutes. <laughs> You go, bye. Get to the stairs as quickly as you can. She just gets scared. She doesn't get bonked, I think, maybe. Also, that sounded far away, wasn't it? I'm still gonna wait, but it sounded kind of far away. Bye, friend. Use the pair of mic, dude. That would be insane. Play it safe. 
Don't risk it. Oh, he's far. All right, here we go. Nice. Go, 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 go. We just need to get back to the stairs. We're probably going to have to be going back and forth for a while. Uh, oh, come on, dude. Okay, well, we made it about two steps. We made it one room closer, guys. <laughs> we got one room closer. Jimmy has the master key, but if you deadlock the door, I think it still locks him in for a little while. Yo, here we go. <laughs> here we go again. Oh, baby. Oh, man. I'm going to become the Joker. <laughs> this is so stupid. Oh, there we go. I can turn off this stupid soundtrack. Thank you. I can turn off. <laughs> He's still here. <laughs> Freaking five minutes later, and he's still walking past the fucking door. Holy shit, dude. What is he doing? He's just playing fucking peekaboo with this guy. <laughs> oh my god. There he goes. He's far away. Okay, he ran away. He ran away. Go, 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 go. Finally. Let's go. Let's go. Please don't kill me. Don't be here. I think I go this way. Uh, I think I'm going the wrong way. Fuck. No, I'm going the right way. Yes. Just leave. Just leave. Okay, we made it out. Let's go. My goodness. That was, uh, that was a long time. <laughs> this is the longest elevator. Okay, third floor. We just need to get to floor 303 and then wait for 30 minutes in that room until he leaves and then we need to go to the exit, probably. 303. That's gonna be obviously right around the corner here. Here we go. It's gotta be in this area. Wait, no, it's not that close, right? Now it's gotta be slightly further. What is this room? This is 302? No, 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 no. This way. 303, right? That's 304. There it is. Open the door. Okay, we made it. We made it. And he's really close. <laughs> Come here, Sky. Hi there. Nice hair. Goodbye. Here you go. <laughs> Get to the elevator as quickly as you can. Don't send her out yet. I can't go and give a shit. <laughs> the fucking laugh. That's the last person released. Now find the exit and get out. Okay. So now it is the patience game. I mean, we're actually so close to the elevator. We literally just have to wait for him to be far enough away and then we leave. Then we're out of here. That's close, right? I don't know if that was close. I I'm gonna listen to a sound, to a, to a sound I wreck. Oh, nope, that was definitely close. <laughs> okay, dude. I can't fucking get enough of the, the back and forth, man. It's so silly. That was still very close. That was the exact same sound as before. <laughs> Whoa. <laughs> it's it never it's never not funny. <laughs> Let's go. He's far. Go 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 go. Finally, only took us like fifteen minutes. Okay, uh, I think it's this way. Is it this way? Oh, no. Uh, I'm gonna get killed. Don't be here. Don't be here. This is almost there. Holy shit, come on. Go. I'm going, I'm going, I'm going, I'm going, I'm going, I'm going, I'm going. Let's go. We made it. <laughs> I love how we're just waiting here when Jimmy is right there. 
The immersion is ruined, but I don't care. We know that works. Go to the ground floor. Get the hell out of here. Bye. <laughs> oh my god. We did that first try. I actually can't believe it. I mean, I can believe it. Once we figured out the strategy, there was like the first three hours, we were totally fine because the game wasn't that hard yet. Then it just became an absolute game of ultra patience. And we weren't patient enough yet until like once we realized that you literally just had to wait or oh wait i can't leave wait excuse me hotel exit key once we realized that's the wrong key wait what i go out the back door like once we realized you just have to wait oh i didn't even need the key what all your friends got out safely! See, there you go. You completed at dead of night on extreme. Oh, there you go. Oh, man. That was so much harder than I expected. <laughs> Goodness gracious. Oh, but yeah, the patience was just key. But it, it was actually really fun. Once I realized... I mean, obviously, it was a little annoying having to wait so long, but... At least we we didn't we stopped dying all the time. Maya! 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 <laughs> Look at this guy. Stop, 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 stop! Stop it! Why do you keep making me do these things? Please just stop. <laughs> Please just stop it. Stop it. <laughs> Terrifying. You're always going to do it, Jimmy. I'm in charge. Not you. <laughs> fucking hair. I'm <laughs> in charge. Goodbye. He's bald. No one's ever gonna go to this hotel. We're gonna report it to the. Why isn't he getting. Why isn't the ending that he gets arrested because we reported him to the police? Like, hello? Oh. Yeah, the, people said there was gonna be a sequel to this game. And each of us is another whom we do not know. We all got a Jimmy? Or a Hugo Punch or whatever? I, I would hope not. <laughs> He speaks to us in dream. Is this the moral of the story? We are, we're all psychopaths. And tells us how differently he sees us from the way we see ourselves. <laughs> what? That's what you took away from this game, Debs? I don't think that's what I took away from this game. <laughs> what the fuck? <clears throat> you can see them? What the hell? At dead of night. They just wanted the title drop so they could roll the credits. Oh, mirror time. Never mind. Infinity mirror. I forgot that it ends like this. What the hell? There you go. Damn, what a cool game. Like... I'm just, I'm so glad it didn't end on the frustrating part, because, like, oh god, it's so loud, I need to turn down the volume. Because uh, there was, like, a period at, at the start of this stream where it was extremely frustrating because we weren't, like, we didn't catch on to that it was literally just sit at the, the peephole until you hear him far away. Like, if you try anything else, you get bonked. That was like what kept happening to us constantly, where we would either get out and immediately get bonked or get out and get bonked like two steps later. And it just, and it led to us having to refine the spirit box and the, the scrying mirror and the compass so many times it was just starting to get extremely annoying. But once we realized that you just got to sit there and wait, it was way better, even though it was obviously kind of annoying and boring. But anyway, very cool game, obviously uh amazing uh such a unique uh gameplay style where you have this like live action like it's literally just real <laughs> uh and 
you're like walking around this real hotel with a guy chasing you. Now, I think Jimmy is a pretty good villain. I can see people be like, he is an extremely goofy guy with an obvious bald cap on. Like his hair is like obviously fake. As you saw in that last uh, cutscene, you saw like him do like him raising his eyebrow and you can just see the line of the <laughs> like bald cap. Like, yeah, it's, it's a little silly, but uh, w maybe it would have been... I don't know. I feel like it could have worked if they just made him a little bit more scary because he's a pretty goofy guy, goofy guy. But uh, I think it also kind of adds to the experience where you're just like being chased by this weird clown guy. With he's not a clown, but he like kind of acts like one with a with a with a like club trying to bonk you it's very silly but it's a lot of fun and it seems like you guys enjoy it as well so yeah i hope you enjoyed this revisiting on extreme mode which oh boy extremo was not messing around it was a freaking struggle but hey we made it to the end we get we beat the damn game and i'm glad we did and hopefully there will be a sequel uh, i'll keep my eye, eye, eyes out for that because the sequel would be amazing because the first game was I mean, pretty iconic. It was one of the first horror games I played was like after Phasmo came out. Uh, and it was, I mean, it was one of the longest series we've ever done. I think I did like an eight part series when I first made this a video on this game. And now I just put it all in one video because I don't know. I, just, I mean, I could cut it into two parts, but I'm probably just going to put it all in one. It depends how long the edit is. If the edit is literally like, I don't know, eight hours long, which I cannot fathom how it would be eight hours long because i need to cut out so much waiting regardless i hope you enjoyed it let me know what you thought if you're not subscribed please do so if you like the video like it if you dislike it dislike it and if you want to join the lovely gamers over here in chat that you can't see because it's on top of a lamp you can join us over at twitch.tv slash instagram click the link in the description down below thank you so much and i'll see you in the next one bye guys have a good one bye bye